Wow, hello, hi, 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 hello, hi. It's, hi, it's everyone. Today, also, yeah, uh, hi. Uh, There's Witcher with us. <clears throat> Witcher is here with us, yes. I, <laughs> I, I remember including you in my freaking, like, you know, the, in, in, the, in, too, the, cas yes. in the cascade, uh, like, announcement art, and I didn't this time because you keep not appearing on the actual Homestuck streams, and now you have, so now I feel bad. <laughs> anyway, I don't care. Okay, <laughs> fine. Uh, maybe you can appear later in the thumbnail. Maybe I'm gonna draw you again. That, I don't know. I don't feel like it anymore. <laughs> that was a very hard for me to draw. Um, pat pat. Pat pat. Okay. <laughs> uh, so hello, 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 hello. Hi, lots of people. Uh. Uh, you were talking about a spin, like a spoiler message. Did somebody send a spoiler message? Oh, no, the comment, the com frick, messages are being deleted in the chat. I see that. Uh, what spoiler message? Did anybody send something important that should be pinned? What spoiler message? Uh, I don't see anything. Hmm. No, considering that this is probably like a probably a big event, I did still don't realize if it's like as big as Cascade or like no, probably less big than, than Cascade. But I, I wonder if it's like as big as the Final Clash. Uh, should we like actually you know write a new spoiler message? Yes. Yeah. Guys, please no spoilers. Seriously, even hinting at or teasing things in the future is spoilers. Please chill, smiley face. There we go. Oh my god, I can't freaking pin it because the like the, 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 the reaction evo to win like thing is opening when I hover over the Can somebody send like one okay thank you. One message. There we go. Bam. <laughs> <clears throat> Luna is dead again? She is still dead. She didn't die a second time. Yes. Someone posted spoilers, don't read up. Okay. Um, it was Kenny's messages I saw deleted, so I'm gonna avoid their messages for a bit. I don't know. I, Luna, can you read Kenny's messages to see if they are bad? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, it was probably Kenny's uh, thing, yeah. Emibor is here. Emibor says spoiler, Dave does a flip pretty soon and it's pretty epic. If that does happen, I... Okay, this, this is the one time I will not uh, treat spoilers bad, because that is pretty awesome. <laughs> uh, is that again to read up too much? The thumbnail art and the and the waiting are both so good. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna sh actually show you guys the the art that I did because I'm pretty proud of it. Let me let me show you. I'm just gonna call it game over. <laughs> Where is it? Where the hacker is it? There we go. This art. I'm pretty proud of it. Look. It's cool, right? I um yeah, I, saw, cool. I, I saw I saw uh, more of uh, Ghost of Pals uh, art on Twitter uh, earlier today and I was like, damn, I need to try those oil brushes. So I tried them. This is my first time trying them. <laughs> so yeah, that that that's 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 what I did. Uh it's me and Luna and You're fine, Kenny, don't worry. Caliborn. Hmm? I'm wondering if Mariam Ahmed, is that supposed to be Is that supposed to be a joke name or something? I don't why is my name Mariam Sh 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 Shmed? Is this the wrong damn account? Hold on. Oh, what? 
Wait, was that as a... Huh? I'm just... I'm still with you. Okay, I already read those. What is happening? I... I, I slash spoiler, S Game Over is not the real name of the Flash. The real name is S Game Over with a... With a dot. <laughs> with a full stop. Okay. I, sorry. Sorry, sorry, thing. I apologize. Let me... Uh, let me fix it real quick. Actually, no, I... Okay, not I can't fix on the image. Never mind. It's, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Game over. Serious. No spoilers. Territory for reasons unmentionable. All right. I love how the deaths of, from, from the end of those screens carry over to the whole sequence for some reason. Yes. Craft. We remember your Undertale fan when he's Undertale for the first time. Genocide. Right. <laughs> we think it isn't. Hello, Miles Malone. Okay, I didn't say hi to everybody. Sorry, to, okay, Ria, Silent ZX, Emibor, Wayrock, uh, Salmo, um, Mariam Ahmed, who I think is Azur actually, uh, General Mituna 2.0, uh, Summer, Thunderstorms, yeah, that's everybody, I think. If I missed somebody, I'm sorry, I'm just in a mess right now. It is understandable. I love that moment where John Eckbert said it's airing time and the game all over them. <laughs> okay. Sure. <laughs> I I think I had something to say at the beginning. Like something relating to where Caliborn is right now. Like the place where, where he makes Homosac. Because I was thinking like, okay, so this is like an exile place, right? So I thought... I'm just I'm not gonna pull up the images, but this is a re realization I had. That uh, it's like an it's like a exile bunker, and uh, my thoughts were okay. Why is he there? Like how how does he have access to one? It must be just that was they are on the veil because you know the full frog temple was on the veil in the veil, and then they when it crashed into the earth it like rebuilt itself. It like grew out of the meteor. So that must be so like those little bunkers for the exiles must also be in the veil just normally by the default. Just just had a little thought there. That's something I wanted to bring bring up, but I didn't, didn't want to like actually search up any of the images I needed for that. Anyway. Right, this is where we ended. This is where we ended. Okay. I think we're gonna... Yeah, okay. Let's see. Oops. Um... I don't know. I'm just gonna play Dogfight again. It's a pretty, like, gen just general epic thing. <laughs> general epic theme song thing uh actually wait is this where we ended i didn't okay this is the page where uh, we ended. i just went went a page ahead sorry yeah okay so this is where we ended we we read the conversation between mina and Vriska. yeah so it definitely seems like more time has passed uh, for them here since the pirate adventure than for John. Because for John it was just like, oh, he woke up and then suddenly, yeah, he went to Roxy and stuff, you know, all of that has stuff happened. Uh, but for them it seems like it must have been like a longer while. You know, time is relative, fucking the dream battles. Okay, so, so, so truly, now, now truly, next page. <laughs> oh man, this is so cool still. So let's see. <clears throat> oh, also, I have dinner, so I'm gonna be like pausing to munch uh, from time to time. All right, just just saying. Jake, your hope field is too dissipating. Come on, man, you don't is dissipating. Come on, man, you don't need to rely on her to keep believing. Try and hold on your crap together and just for a little longer. Oh, cause his fakeness is increasing. Oh no. Oh, that's an all. Fiddle, fiddle. Oh, yeah. uh... <laughs> Fiddle Maybe battle. today you can try streaming to us. Okay, on this I, I, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. We'll see. We'll see. God damn it, Jake! Oh, that's that's not good. Hi, Rose. <laughs> Mr. Strider. <laughs> oh, <the laughs> okay. <laughs> um, what are you doing to this troll, if I may ask? Get her the frick out of here! Okay. Oh, hi. Roxy? Gotcha. 
Oh, wow, okay. Huh. <laughs> Look at her face. Does This is like the actual first time they actually meet. Like, Rose was looking forward to it, but I suppose wrong time, because Dirk was uh, duking it out with uh, me, uh, pff, Aranea there. Aranea. Damn. Is the stream okay? On the, on the Discord? Uh, it is for now, yeah. Okay. It's like a bit low quality, but not too much. It's watchable. Okay. Okay. Faddle faddle. <laughs> I'm here, I am here. Hi, Wayrock. You managed to actually, like, catch up. God damn, okay. I am on time. Hi, Wayrock. <clears throat> let me... Okay, last time I did a pretty piss poor job at doing the Terezi voice, that, but that's fine. Uh, let me try again. Can I have one of your loud cheese wheels? Okay. Why won't you fight back? Yeah, fake is increasing. And the hope field is lessening again. Is... Oh! The mind control... Why won't you say something? Because he has mind control, Terezi! Hi, Jane. Oh, Rose and the Roxy over there. She, she, Roxy is sleeping. Roxy is fine. Jade is not fine, but... But she... What you're looking at? Hmm. Okay. I mean, this is uh -oh. what... This is what Jane wanted, right? Well, I mean, like, evil Jane. And fakeness is very high right now. Oh, boy. <laughs> Why won't you die? Oh, Therese. Forgive me, Jake. Oh. D Jane, is this necessary? Jane, is this... Ne I... I don't think... I don't think that's... Her um... What? I... What? No, 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 Shock. I, okay. <laughs> oh, my stars and girls. <laughs> oh. So that's, oh, damn. So, uh, okay, G brain goes, Dirk g went back to being not real. Um, dead, just dead, just straight up dead. Okay, well, I'm, gu I'm guessing that he'll be like revived by Jane, or e even when while Jane is evil, she she's planning to revive him, but Jesus, Jesus, Dead. <gasps> oh! Oh no! Oh, I'm munching, sorry. Jacob England died, made the queen rest in peace. Your PFP is one thing too. What? Your PFP is one thing too. Yeah, I mean, no, 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 my PFP is full of pilk. <laughs> they, are, they are full of pilk. That's what they are. Yeah, this is fine. Okay. Go to grief, that was painful! Oh! Yeah? And ter back to Terezi. Oh no, she's crying! <gasps> Terezi, whoa! Please stop! You're motherfucking hurting me! Uh, hot, sad honk! Oh no! Oh! What? I don't even, like, have any comprehension to comment on what's happening right now. Oh, God! Frank. What have I done? And she's back. Oh, wait, no, never mind. She's not doing it again. Okay, so she's... She's gonna put Jane to sleep. I thought she was uh, bringing back Gamzee into the, uh, the, the manipulation. Uh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Very large robotic Z. <laughs> so, okay. Z. Nice mouth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I. I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. No. What? What? What's that? What? Huh? 
Honk! I... But he was okay! He was ju okay just now! Why? Wh huh? Why? What? No! You can't... No! I... Yeah. Did, did he just consume too much too, too much of the Caliborn pills for, for that? Just, just too much Caliborn? That this is just the default now? Really? Oh. Okay, this her robotic part is gonna still okay. Z tackle robotic tackle. Okay. <laughs> well, this is quite the like. Cover. The predicament. So. Yeah, yeah. Well, that and also like completely different moods on top of the building and over here. Yeah. <laughs> All right. This is like that one that, that time when when Jacobs was on robot. It's all right. Interesting strategy. Oh no! Wait, Stardust is coming. Why is Stardust coming back? Is it, it ha it has it been too long since John has been here? Yeah, that's that's that is definitely stuck. Oh my God! What the? Oh no! 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 Terezi blood! Terezi blood! No! 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 Punch, 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 hey, punch. Quite a, moder quite a moderate amount of it, too. Uh-huh. I see that. What's what's that flashing? I feel like I recognize those colors, but I'm not sure. Dirk's unbreakable katana. That still is real for some reason. Even though it should be fit. Oh, okay, so, okay, he's just gonna... He Jake is just gonna revive normally. I see. Yeah. That I mean, that makes sense, yeah. Oh no. Oh god. Uh, Jake has... J J Jake, do you... Yeah? You see what's... Oh no. No, 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 no. Why does this have to be happening? Gamzy, stop that! <clears throat> oh wait. Uh, is this some sort of black room thing? I certainly hope not. No, no, it's no, it's this is too intense for just black rom, no. Yeah. <laughs> think, Lalon, think. What did Kanaya tell you about this quadrant? Does it really involve such gruesome fisticuffs? I I can't remember. I was prob probably drunk during that particular lesson. What am I saying? I was drunk for all of the lessons. <laughs> what a disgrace! I am the actual worst auspice who who has ever uh, ever lived. The actual worst! Yeah, you, you got yourself into quite the problem on the last year of the meteor journey, huh? Oh my goodness gracious, that's horrible. Oh no. Uh, I am not enjoying seeing this. Come yeah. suplex, okay. I, sure. Yeah, you know what? Yeah. Oh, oh, that... Yeah, she is... Uh, Ther is Therese gonna be fine? Like, is Jane gonna... I mean, Jane is probably gonna be able to do this, but is is Jane gonna? Will Jane... Uh huh? Atomic Double Juggalo... Atomic Double Juggalo Backbreaker! I was just gonna say... Oh my god. This panel. <laughs> oh my god! She's not fine. She is yeah, not she fine. Is not fine. I there is no dead text yet. Ah! Let, not the not the lie. What? What? Yeah, my reaction. My actual reaction. What? Yeah. Uh. Terezi. No. Yep. Oh no, he's seeing the guy. Oh no. Oh no. What? But like the the fork. That's Kaya. Yeah. I mean, yeah, but that's a big problem. Wait, does it actually represent the actual Skya? Yeah? What? But like, that is it connected to the actual Skya? Yeah? Like the plot? Huh? How? What? Wait, no. Is is it Skya? Yeah? Like the. Uh... But like how? Because Jane already had that fork like before. Like how would she even make this? What? Is Kaya just like 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 that like that right now? Is it gonna be a big ball of lava now? What? Huh? 
that she actually there is no dead dead uh, dead full stop text yet as her hopefully hopefully god damn i think this is a really tragic moment for gamzy the first time he's himself in years and his old friend trying to stab him to death and then that lord english influence comes by yeah, exactly god damn Scalafed, yeah like i genuinely feel bad for gamzy hi hello dreamy flower and hello her egg is on fire Uh, Hope versus Rage throw hands now, Jake. I don't. I think Jake is too flabbergasted right now. Um. Oh no. So it's, oh, by the way, it's been so interesting. Going back to Jake. So I. It's, this is we're seeing this here. So this is this is obviously we're aware of these things, but over here, this mirage is showing us that Jack and PM are going to Jade's uh, dream bed, or sorry, uh, quest bed. So that's uh, also a ca car cut pulled out the home smell you later and the chainsaw Kanaya. It's you know okay I'm gonna say, just say here, wasn't the freaking crab claw sickle like basically better than home smell you later and didn't Kanaya have like two bas basically two better chainsaws? Why does she keep coming back to the lipstick one? She has one more that does more damage. I'm pretty sure. Oh. No, that is no, 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 that no, no, Gamzy, what the hell? No, uh uh, no, no, I, why, no, pardon me, Sir Jester. Oh my god, Jake. Help her! Don't just- You can fly! You can save her! Jake! Jake, no! Pardon me, Sir Jester. I don't know what this masked bandit has done to b b deserve such a throttling. Something as sufficiently felonious, I presume? But it is hard to imagine she has not been punished enough and then some. Perhaps you could, um, uh, if it's not too much to bother, see to unhanding, unhanding the lady? Uh, maybe? <laughs> Winky honk! Enough! <gasps> a quill of echidna. I don't care if this this is some sort of gri grisly courtship ritual. This has to stop. Good. God damn it, Rose. Yes. Good. Where is, where are you? Somewhere in the sky? Oh, did, did Gamsi pull yeah. her back? Spell. Oh, J Jake is flying now. Okay. Um, okay, what is, what now? Why is it, why is Vriska's... She's trying to reach for her cane. Yeah, she's, she's trying to reach for her blade, but why is Vriska's eye, like, flashing there? What, what's hap, what, huh? Oh, wait, no, that's, that's Aranea, never mind. Yeah. Oh, she, how? Is she levitating it? How? What? Yank, never. Okay, well, that gums. Oh, Rose, please help. No, not Rose. This is bad. Not the middle finger Very too. Bad. That was. And what's she giving it to? Pink. I don't. Again, this is not p like pure Gamzy. This is. J this is a lot of a, a lot a lot a lot of. Lord English influence here, okay? Like just act actual, actual juju magic Lord English influence. It's not just Gamzy it himself. Unfortunately, Jake's confidence in his own judgment has probably been destroyed by this point. Oh, you, you are, yeah, you are actually pretty correct on that. Yeah, that's that's a fair assumption to make. Jake is like a lost a so so Victorian child. Oh no. Now y'all know why me and my homies hate Gamzy. Again, this is not. Mm. I will not hate Gamzy because of this. Because of what I said before. Like again, there is. Uh, my God! Hi, Donny Cut Jr. Mangot. Hello, uh, Israel YouTube. Hello. Okay, we already said J. Okay, okay, okay. Just, just, just seeing if there are people, people that I've missed. 
like that kindness we saw when he wasn't sober had to have uh, come from somewhere. And yeah, yeah. Like, the reason why, like, when he went sober, we thought that, oh, sober Gamzee equals evil Gamzee automatically. But that was just because, like, he, um... Him having Lil Cal on him while sober made him especially, like, vulnerable there. I imagine if he was still, like, on his pie stuff, that then he, he wouldn't have had, like... It wouldn't have had as much, in, like, influence on him, because he was just kind of meh to everything. So, again, just Cal. It's all Cal, pretty much. And, like, ex extremely unfortunately. What, what is what is flashing? Was that green? Oh, that's that's just the forest fire, yeah. Oh hell no! Okay, okay, you guys gonna you guys gonna do something? Let her go this instant, you highness cold pa packing <laughs> crap mime! We aren't gonna hide it out this time, bro! I'll tell you that much right freaking now! Honk What the oh. <laughs> What's what? What what, 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 what you are seeing? Okay. I don't know. Oh, crap. Oh, uh, 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 yep. It's her. Condi is here, just straight up. Not, not working from the shadows anymore, I guess. Okay. I, that's a problem for, like, everybody, I think. Hi. Oh, boy. Um. Oh, it's just the condo slime. Oh my god, that's a <laughs> mad stop. What's a worse... We already had Jack here. It's fine. What's a worse fate? Fafari in the peta doomed by the narrative to never be relevant, or Gamzee doomed by the narrative to be the villain? I, I don't know, man. I don't know. Oh boy. Why, why, why you, why you doing that? Huh? Is it cold? Are you? Like that because it's cold. <laughs> oh, that's a that's a redraw, right? Because that that's like a reuse of when she was confronted yeah. by the, the handmaid. Um. All right, she she be screaming. Be all right, angry. she be screaming. What? This is the mm -hmm. the end of the intermit. Okay. What? But uh, but 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 but. That's the end. Yeah. Condes is there, I guess, now. Oh, boy. Um, PM and Jack... PM, Jack this and... Seems good. PM, Jack, Jade, and Dave are out of the picture right now, but that's because they're literally out of the picture. Like, this specific picture. They, they're probably gonna come back. <laughs> yeah. um, well, that's quite the place to end, I Hmm. Cliffhanger. Okay, uh, let me get a Caliborn song real quick. Uh, it's just Red Sucker, sure. Red, Red Sucker again, from from Cherubim. Um, Homosack, I guess. Act 6, Act 6, Act 3. Oh, I'm yeah. not Comic Paradox. We all missed it. This is what, okay. Wayrock told me this. So, apart, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, this is the 17th of October. Uh, and if 2014. We, and this is the no, this is 16. So what is what's with the the year craft the year? Oh, the year! Oh it's my god! 366 days later. It's an actual year later. Oh my god! Yeah. Full year no home. That's why they say we'll come back. Oh god, okay, so that's why the Gigapos was there. So yeah, this is this is all of Paradox Space was unlocked just now, because this is this is what occupied the HS fans in that time. Yeah, that's why I said, that's why when you said it was all of Paradox Space, can I read all of it before Game Over? I said, no, probably, actually, maybe. <laughs> yeah, because, okay. So this was, so we just went over the Gigapos, okay. That's what it is. Damn, okay. <clears throat> Welcome back, again. Your Im un impatience has been appreciated. 
I can only assume that waiting for the next installment in my vaunted series Homo Sack was as time consuming for you as it was for me. I have been working my arse off, like one of your human motherfuckers, at perfecting my craftsmanship. You are probably wondering if the fruits of my labor's toil were extremely successful. I believe you will find the answer to be the, f the following word. Yes! <laughs> oh, he made himself an award. Wow. Whoa, Hamasaka is back. Peak is here. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for that, Wayrock. The gigak pause would have been the micro pause if the peta was there. I'm sure. Why not? <laughs> hey, craft. Do you want to hear a bad joke? Uh, okay. The giga pause would have ended if I was there. Of course, it would have, Azur. <laughs> craft realizing the horror of the hiatuses. I can imagine it was just like horrible for people who are just used to checking in daily to see the new, like at least one new page. That must have been... You see, I, I have been watching, like, uh, c quite a few people, uh, like, reacting to all of the major S pages. And almost all of the time, it's like, hey, welcome back, everyone. It's been a long time, and I don't remember much about Homestuck, but let's watch yeah. this. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that's kind of funny. Rohan Vora also is here. Hello. Thank God we get to see Caliborn's improved art style. I... I'm guessing that he, he considers himself now fit to draw them animes, so that's gonna be interesting. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I didn't notice this, but what the hell is that emissary of uh, the devil doing next to Luna's cadaver? Uh, that's uh, Witcher's PFP. Witcher, say hi. Hi. You can't tune a bear, but you can me tune a fish. I. <laughs> that was a bad joke. You're correct. You, you were correct, Kenny. <laughs> okay. Um. All right. Homosac. I have done it. Where the fine arts are concerned, I have reached the pinnacle of Achievement Mountain. I stab my cane into the peak like a flag, thus making a snowy avalanche onto the haters below. Been jealous match, fat arse. <laughs> okay. So, when I said that he was being level-headed, when he mentioned that his skill level isn't enough for the animes yet, I was praising him for not succumbing to the Dunning-Kruger effect. Uh, him saying that he's literally at the top uh, of artistic ability uh, is uh, definitely undoing that compliment for, from me. <laughs> How do you, I do such a sensational feat, you ask? Okay. Okay. The mystery to success lay hidden amidst the Byzantine mangas all along. These occult wizardries of the brush, purloined from cool scrolls of wise men from the Earthling East, have been gathered for my studious personal in in inside a seductive tome, emblazoned with a fr frivolous tart. However, mastering each sly gambit of the trade is no easy task, and yet easily mastering them with great difficulty is exactly what I did. Easily mastering them with great difficulty. I bro. <laughs> he knows his language, don't worry. Okay. Me when the English language. Munching? Munching time? Nom, nom, nom. Thank you, Ari. Later, for dinner, I have nuggies, by the way. Cool. <laughs> Thank you, I won't be I here all night. I wanted to night. announce that. Okay, cool. Thank you, I won't be here all night. Thank you, Homestack Fandom, you've been horrible. <laughs> JK Hart, you guys, Hong Kong. Alright. Wayrock, you can't be, be a contest pro, prostrator and a true English believer at the same time. Only one is true. Wh huh? Are you colorboard, my lord? I have been waiting for Peaks update. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> so proud of this little gremlin. I hate him. True. You underestimate my abilities, Azur. <laughs> okay. 
It's exactly what I did. Uh, this fact is called a game changer. <gasps> oh my gosh. More, more homo sack characters. To professionals in the business, that is. Previously, before I literally transformed into the supreme doujinshi mangaka, standing before your very eyes, I have some predictable plans regarding what dog goes next in my story. I got everything ready. Drew all of the trolls. Look, all of your favorites are here. Uh, crab, crab, honk, friend, cape, douche. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah, I see him, I see him, yep. Smelly horse man, other guy, bullhorn wimp. How dare you call Solux other guy? How dare you? My goodness. How dare you? No, 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 you don't, mm. Ay, 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 man. Caliborn's actual god tier is Man of Gek. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and lest we forget, a salty array of miscellaneous dames. <laughs> wow, it's a, it's a radiant, a pet, a fairy, Terezi, Frisk, and Kanaya. The binches. <laughs> the binches. Okay. <laughs> sure. Didn't even, no, they're truly so didn't, here. Didn't, even, didn't even give them fake names. Damn. Didn't he, did not even give them fake names. I like that he remembers Echoes more than Solux. I... <laughs> no. <laughs> and oh, also, before trolls, in case of emergency. The before trolls. <laughs> <laughs> Just mirror the negative. Okay, sure, sure, sure. Such as in case I was in need of more fictitious idiots to murder inside my drawings. I, I see. But these portraits are now a moot point. Oh no. No, not to the garbage. No. In a strange way, this is actually the opposite of a lot of what a lot of people d d did, right? Because a lot of people knew Homestuck because of the trolls. So when they started and saw humans, they just skipped to the trolls. And even then, they didn't like it. That's something that I heard people they experience, right? So uh, the, him throwing the trolls in the garbage is actually kind of like, like against the, the whole allegory of all of this. The bitches don't get names. Mine are better. <laughs> Have to actually put slash J here. Not everyone knows I girl. Yes. Every one of these look like they're about to cry. That is correct. I think I saw a realistic rendition of Crab Crab at some point. That would that genuinely did look like he was about to cry. <laughs> Who's a real Act Five si Act Five skipper? Me. <laughs> No, that that's Dark Mage, not you, Azur. I can other guy. Good, other guy is peak character. I think the chat thingy is broken. Oh, you you are correct on that. Let me see if I can fix it. Stream elements. Technical difficulties, yeah. Ole mole. Hell yeah, baby. Wait, it moved. Did it? Wait, now it moved, but it's like late. It's moving, but the the, mm -hmm. the, the widget is light. Oh, that's that's weird. Why is it always weird? It's always weird. You're always weird. All of this wretched trash goes in the place where it belongs, which is to say, the garbage. I am the trash man. I eat garbage. I throw garbage all over the ring. <laughs> That's what happens when you are an, an artist. Sometimes you change your idea plans because they suddenly seem terrible. Due to your astronomical strides and creative mastery, these were the pixel puppets of a laughable amateur. They are beneath me now, much like you are. Okay. 
But in spite of all of your bad shortcomings, I will let you observe my artistic breakthroughs because of how proud of them I am. And watching people be impressed at my drawings, even dumb jerks, makes me feel great about myself and my accomplishments. Behold! My exclusive private gallery! <laughs> Deviant, I am your- I am looking this up right now. Deviant <laughs> art, I am your lord. Oh yeah, it does exist. It does exist. It does exist. Oh my god, it, it does exist. It does exist. Beauty. Okay, yeah. no, no, no. Okay, I'm not. I'm not looking at it further because this is probably like gonna be images that we're gonna see. Gonna see in the comic. But oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> uh, it makes fun of a fan theory. What fan theory? What fan? That's Jake science. is Lord English. That Jake is Lord. <laughs> oh, okay, I will see. <laughs> I mean, it was pretty much a red herring, right? At one point. Yeah. I skipped Act 5 in, in its entirety. Why is John Blue? Why are there four new kids? What is this crutch? Who is this school man? <laughs> By Act 5 skipper, I mean I saw everything but Act 5. I don't know who these great people are and I don't want to know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, for Danny Caliborno. True. It's real deviant art. Uh, Lord's Peak Art Academy. I, I've seen, I have seen a very incredible, awesome Twitter account that is also called I Am Your Lord, and it's just literally somebody role-playing as Lord English making art. And that is very funny, I think. <laughs> Abraka freaking Dabra, you nasty crap nerds. Read it and weep. And tell me how good you think it all is. Thanks. Okay, that's enough admiration. Back to our story. <laughs> Copyright. Do not steal. Dave. Oh my. Dave has never looked uh, more amazing. <laughs> look, yeah. Look at those big old eyes. Do you enjoy? Yes, obviously. <laughs> look who just swaggered into your freaking business. It's God's gift to the Yowies. <laughs> my research tells me. Get a load of those baby reds. <laughs> I'm getting a lot of those baby rats. You may recollect that this blushing bishon in Dreamboat. <laughs> <laughs> this is my property. Is <laughs> our alpha male. <laughs> Love that account. It's real, by the way. How do you even skip like this? How Oro from Neon Genesis Evangelion? I don't. I haven't not. I have not watched that show. I know that is good. Don't first time readers always skip to Act 5? I think they used to. Some people were like desperate for other fans to start reading Homestuck and so they were like, oh, skip to Act 5 because that's the be be best part. But then like people uh, read that instead of anything else and uh, they are confused and they don't want to read anymore. So that was, that's, that, that, I know that that was like a strategy. So people pulled that, oh, to get others into uh, the comic, I should say skip to Act 5, but then it never worked, I'm pretty sure. I'm the. This is the only way I'm drawing Dave from now on. <laughs> no, you're is allowed, Tomat. Caliborn and I have Papyrus both don't understand how anime works. Sure. I think I have Papyrus has a better idea of how anime works. I think I think he does. Scalafed, do you say that yet Caliborn didn't allow Jake to draw Yaoi? Huh. I think he changes changed his mind. You know. Also, no, it didn't allow uh, Dirk to draw Yaoi, not Jake. <laughs> Is our alpha male. Not that I blame you for not recognizing him, for his once previously odious vis visage or of before, but now, by my sk skillful hand, this gorgeous male hero has been allowed to radiate with the supreme divinity of boy manga heaven. <laughs> Is that what you're calling shonen boy manga? Alright. Oh my, what do we have here? That... <laughs> Big copyright. <laughs> We're doing this, man. We're making this happen. <laughs> Don't look now, but another bashful bishy approaches the stage. It's our, our troll male, crab guy. Quite a temper, this one. He be 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 bellows himself <laughs> a horse daily. At our smart talking, give no freak, alpha male. These mo bros put the pal in palpable, chemi palpable chemistry, the kind of which is bad as well as erotic. The sage elders of manga describe the quadrant that they occupy as, I quote, Sundere. <laughs> Sundere. 
Sundar as a romance quadrant? Okay. <laughs> Dave Cat, yeah. do it, Caliborn, do it, make it happen, Dave Cat. Oh my god, Azor is freaking out. He loves Dave Cat so much. <laughs> We're making this happen, bro. I did too. Car Dave. It's not Car Dave! It's the Dave Cat. <laughs> Get with the program. <laughs> Just really, really big, transparent copyright signs everywhere, yeah. Honestly, me. <laughs> I'm here, I was asleep for too long, but I'm here. Hello, your average player. It is a tempestuous liaison. I don't know what this word is. Of mutual grievance. And yet, deep down, they know in each other's heart that they are solid dudes. Okay, I know what you're thinking. It's literally the yeah. This this is literally we're making br we're making it happen. Br Step off. This is wrong. What is going on here? The touching. The tenderness. I know it. You know it. Let's not play a game with each other. Where perchance are the binches? I can hear you ask. You raise an excellent point. But hear me out. <laughs> 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 this is why it took a yeah. This is why it, this is why, this is why, yeah. <laughs> this was awful, this was awful, what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean, Pink? Are you homophobic? Is that it? Are you homophobic? <laughs> ban, ban. <laughs> Pink yaoi. Crab, crab alpha male is my favorite ship. True. I absolutely love Dave Cat, but I gotta say I hate this specific Dave Cat. You're just a hater. <laughs> Hello, Spay SQ. Yowie's rejoice! I love Yowie! <laughs> Me when I stop by the Yowie! <laughs> Thank you, BTS. <laughs> Calabon was learning Mangaka style for a year for this. Yes. I'm homophobic to men and men only. Yuri only! <laughs> Don't don't say that, because there are people who genuinely say that, and it's terrible. The mangas play by different rules. You will agree with this when you hear the facts by my rationale. Naturally. Okay, so he's like, okay, so gayness can only appear in mangas. Got it. Naturally, such maudlin displays of touching and simpering have no place where only cocksure masculine gentlemen are present. However, by the man Gaka's illusionary, he changes everything. Where before our males were coarse, chiseled, and crudely angular, built for pride time, like a frickin' garbage truck plowing through the wall of an industrial beef mill, so cat, so maxed out. That they could only provide inside a young man thoughts of raw power, never debauchery. Until now, that is, because of manga and its inherent capability to transform all that is hard and cruel into figures of sublime beauty. Is this a very elaborate way of saying, I have discovered. <laughs> I have discovered what a twink is, and I like it! <laughs> <laughs> this is what he's saying. Guys, like, listen to him. This is what he's saying. I find this art... I find this artifice to be much like the siren spell of the trickster, yet impossibly even more haunting in its allure. I must say, the artistic ploy is ingenious. <laughs> It opens up so many possibilities to, to, the, to the fiend of indecent smut, where before it was all but impossible to render truly sentimental imagery without resorting to babes and bimbos galore, to the utterly unacceptable happenstance wherein macho guys are physically poignant with each other. Okay, so he's saying that uh, yaoi's and gay men have to be rendered in this specific way, otherwise they are too masculine for to be gay. I Caliborn, you have an interesting view on the world. <laughs> yeah. Caliborn hated women so much he realized he can just date men. This is yes. Caliborn is coming out and we do not support him. Go back to your basement, please. <laughs> My lord, show your homosexual yaoi pride. <laughs> Thank you, Wayrock. 
Why are you so passionate? Um, passionate, lol, haha. What, me? Or Wayrog? We need to get that one Yaoi base meme. Oh, that. <laughs> the big guy and the little guy? Okay. Do you want do you want so, so, some some slime? No, I don't. Sorry. <laughs> what? You don't. Look at Dave's lips. Why are they? Why? 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 Why was that a thing for a while? It's still a thing in anime where the lips outline is on the side, but the actual mouth is over here. It's honestly stupid. Just if you want a side. I mouth, haven't seen it in many years. I, I have Actually, I don't think I've ever seen it. I have seen it in some clips I've seen of like miscellaneous animes. But uh, like if you're gonna have a side mouth, just remove the lip outline, god damn it. <laughs> <sighs> the question is who is the big guy and who is the twink between them? Uh, big guy is Karkat, I think. <laughs> if the gays don't accept him, I will, I will, Yuri lovers accept Caliborn. <laughs> damn. Damn. Which is too reasonable man is is the most unwelcome persuasion of leisure, or that is, it was. Until now. Look how smart this hoax is, thanks to manga see. Through the elegance of beauty and finesse, it softens the, the uncouth male exterior, believing the angles of pure muscle, taming his incredible angriness, and by the flashing of cheeks, the doing of brow, and the glaze glassing of the eyes one brings out of, of any brute his true inner bishy, which actually is mang manganese for a beautiful freaking dude. Manganese? <laughs> manganese! <laughs> If you are confused, basically the idea is you pretend them to, to look more like girls to make it less weird for everybody when they decide to touch each other. That is horrible and I'm pretty sure there are people who actually think this way and I don't know what to say to them. <laughs> I mean, it is repulsive to witness, do not get me wrong, but yet it remains magical in its for uh, for forbidden forbiddenality. <laughs> the hands. Oh, oh, hold on. Artwork by Calibor. <laughs> oh, but what's this? No! No, to get this off my screen! Get this off my screen! An enormous, <laughs> an amorous female Sasha is into the sexual patient. It was part of Stop! No! I am not looking. Do, don't be deceived by the fact that this is this feline floozy is too unimportant for me to bother naming. This is an original character to who shall not be stolen. Please respect my property. The saccharine twit has some interests which include giggling, making me puke, using cat words instead of normal words, serving no purpose, wearing stupid gloves, probably smelling horrible. Stop! Not Nepeta! D no, D uh, sir, Donnie, stop! No! The peta would smell like weed. She would smell like weed, but also, uh, that image was horrible. I mean, no, they're like, no, Agree. just. D Caliborn, you're. I hope she was aged up. Caliborn! <laughs> getting mur. Seven? Getting murdered in drawings. Bleh. Um, can someone say owned? Moving on. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> well, well, well. God damn it. Fla <laughs> flashbacks to the Eduardo meme. God damn it. Well, 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 well. What do we have here? <laughs> <laughs> this this just looks really stupid. This image is the private belonging of a professional. <laughs> No, 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 therapy, no. Stop. Stop. Also like this, stop. So he's around their age. Well, I... No, I know, I know that he is. I know that he is. I'm just, whatever. I love how, I love how he made her jointed. He did, he did, yeah. The frickin' arm. This is something that I could see myself drawing a couple of years ago. I'm still not good at drawing arms. Like, don't get me wrong, but I mean, I'm, I'm I over mean, look at the this. The, uh, yeah, I see it, yeah. 
No wild. Also, the leg leg is a noodle. Yeah, yeah. The, the noodle, yeah, the noodle. <laughs> I, okay, I mean, if we remember that this over there, this Okay. I need bleach. I forgot that existed, has UI, God. I clean up on aisle my pants. Stop! No! <laughs> Do not. Witcher, no. I, I read what that is said. illegal. That is illegal. <laughs> Can I put a link in chat? I want to share my Dave Cut version of the Yaoi I mentioned earlier. Did you draw it, Dreamy? If so, I mean, sure, if so, sure. Saddest help, I need a hug. Clean up on us. No, Azur, no, 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 no. I know you're joking. <laughs> I know you're joking, but no, stop. Okay, that's that, that's a bit too much, uh, Skelefetti. Yeah, that is way too much, uh, Skelefetti. No, that, no, that has, no. Erm, um, one ticket to hospital. No, stop. Sp Spay, no. <laughs> hello, hello. <coughs> Hello, boys. This plucky strumpet seems to say with her eyes. She is looking to horn the frick in on our two top dogs, illegal passion paradise. She is no doubt hoping for muchas smooches. <laughs> Fat chance, sister. Idiot girl number whatever likes. <laughs> One, total failure. Two, getting friend zoned by quality male honchos. Three, living in perpetual disgrace. Four, being a complete freaking third wheel to some cool boys. Okay, hold on. Okay, here. This. I'm guessing this is ca like Caliborn's interpretation of what happened in Meteor Stack. Like, as in. You know, the whole thing with Karkat actually that, that having a mate. Made spread crash on her and like having a thing there but then being disturbed by what was going on with Dave assuming things too quickly and stuff like all of that but Karkat was the one who fumbled there right but because he's the male obviously Caliborn sees Teresi as the fumbler there so that's uh also interesting be a complete freaking third wheel to some cool boys not being worth the alpha male's time of day not being worth the crab grab's time of day Seven, not being worth anything, aka worthless. Blech. Oh god, bye! Okay. Her hand. This is like something that an AI will generate at, at like, at random. I think Caliborn was skipping through everything, so all he sees is Dave and Karkat being gay as hell, and and all of a sudden Dave and Terezi break up. <laughs> sure. Feel free to steal this one. <laughs> That's amazing. Thank you for pointing that out, Rohan. Terezi.exe? Blood from the eyes? What? <laughs> I think I why, but, ima but imagine Terezi sniffing this drawing of her and loving how crappy it is, like... I mean, she likes sweet bro and hella Jeff, so, you know, sure. <laughs> Here comes another prime OC of mine, hot of the press. The Registered with the government as my legal artistic possession. Not too shabby, right? You can just tell this lucky lady is brimming with chutzpah. <laughs> ah, like this lucky lady is brimming with chutzpah. He th me thinks she will be a very controversial character with excessive complications and ambig ambiguous moral stuff in her personality bull bullet points. Okay, yeah, I mean, sh yeah. Her traits and other such character things will be a lot to list, which is fine because it will help you believe my creation is more interesting. In fact, with this is one of such advantage of dom dominating all known manga as I have done. When you're this good and brilliant, you don't even really need to tell stories anymore. You can just make some characters and list their various qualities extensively and that's good enough. I'm guessing this is Andrew taking a dig at 
just people who make OCs on the internet, but you know, it, it, it's a different thing than making a story. Like, just making OCs is different than making a, just a, a something that has a story. <laughs> I don't know. This part, though. <laughs> I'm assuming this, in, in turn, is a dig at people who can't see the grayness, how you're not either supposed to like her or, like, completely like her, at least, or, or hate her necessarily that completely. And how people, mm -hmm. like, those people would need, <clears throat> sorry, how those people would need, like, uh, you know, uh, like, all of her, all of her traits listed out to actually see it, I guess. I don't know, maybe something similar to that. Oh my goodness, it's Vivzy Pop Circleish. That is not how a Vivzy Pop character looks, I'm sorry. <laughs> Too fast. Huh? Too far to be a Vivzy Pop character. Okay. <laughs> Has he projecting his hatred of anime and weaves onto Caliborn is my favorite. It's not his, I don't think he hates it. I think he's just had, make just overall making fun without hating it. I don't know. Or they, sorry. I keep forgetting. A Vivzy Pop character. We may never know what they're making fun of. But they're making fun of something. Definitely. Probably. <laughs> I don't see the link. For some, it's not showing up on my chat. Sorry, Jimmy Flower. Putting sparge next to this peak. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. The many, many intriguing personal facts of this mm, truculent female provocateur shall be listed extensively as follows. Psych out! She actually thought she was going to be relevant. Keep dreaming, binge. Okay. No! It's a thing we've mastered enough time on these nobodies. Did you did you misspell I? Yeah. <laughs> Don't you? Let's drop the bullcrap and stop freaking around. You are probably wondering who is responsible for all this mayhem, you ask. Uh-oh, here he comes. No. Hold the freaking phone. Don't look now, but it's none other than the big man himself. Damn! <laughs> Just damn. Okay, start. <laughs> this is our villain, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> this is him. This is what he sees himself as, clearly. Yeah. yeah please, yes. No, this is a Bibsy Pop character. <laughs> Damn. It actually thing is, it I think, is. I think Azure might be severely attracted to this. Yeah, I. Th <laughs> Why does he have the Jack Scar and the wings? Um, he's just awesome, you know. <laughs> peek, peek, peek! Hear me out. Stop, space. No. <laughs> okay. Oh no. And Charm's prototype. I no, I don't think so, Yak. <laughs> Azur. Guys, don't go too down bad, okay? Okay? I hug his head with... <laughs> oh my god. Caliborn draws just the best lightning bolts. Neck is too thick to be a Vivzy Pop character, plus basic bow tie, plus, plus L plus ratio. I see, interesting. Very interesting, Pink Lovely. Not every Vivzy Pop character has a bow tie. I know, I know. She, they, like, she was making a joke, it's fine. To Hello, Tobias. Welcome to the stream. He has the Jack's current wings because the old design prediction was that he was gonna be a version of Jack. Oh, so that's what you meant by make, making fun of a fan theory. Were there like fan designs for what Evil Lord English would look like, maybe? I don't know. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> Who you ask? Who you ask is this brooding beautiful dude? This is yours truly, my self-insertion guy. <laughs> this is self-insertion. Holy shit. Which is my... Forty people are watching. Forty people are watching this. I don't, don't tell me the number, I'm gonna, it's gonna stress me out. Which is my prayer. Yeah, I was gonna, I wasn't gonna because of that, yeah. 
Which is my prerogative to do as, as an artist. I learned this from my master, the wise arsed ghost who haunted my computer. He was the best there was at stuff like this. He once told me, he, he told me once, truly he was quite the piece of crap. Do you mean, do you mean John? Like, huh? Were there more encounters we didn't see? Seriously, can I get a god damn? Holy smokes! Hey god. <laughs> the hand! Oh my god, this is, this is incredible. Ask any decorated scholar to the school of Manya and he will say, before you stands the yaoiest motherfucker who has ever lived. All the things about this gorgeous bastard tell you loud and clear. This is a man of class and style. He is addressed to kill, literally, yeah, yes. Look at this, this fancy Dan, strutting his stuff and dapper as frick. Your boy here, peacocks hard at honeys aplenty, nagging them the binges and closing the <laughs> dames in a coat that is fit for a lord. Look at that goddamn coat. I don't know how he gets that. I don't know how he gets that coat. Probably due to the shenanigan that takes place later. I doubt it matters that much. It looks great though, and I love it. I mean, Kurlo, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's like Kurlos acquires the, the the coat, like the Vriska pirate coat, and then it's prototyped with something, 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 eventually becomes the Lord English coat that we see in, like, first in intermission, I guess. Also, how about a hat? A, fe a fedora. <laughs> Freaking <Yeah>. incredible! <laughs> <laughs> peak design now. Peak. Peak. Sure, why not? The hat is not canonical to my fanon, but I do not see the harm in such a dignified accessory. Ah, yes, perfect. Who could ever be sarcastic, uh, accused of being an a-hole while wearing that? Nobody. Were nice guys a thing in 2014 already? I guess they were. Uh, like the nice guy stereotype, I mean. Yes, ah. Yeah. Uh, that's a fedora. Our lord has the right to not say his messiah's doings. Who the hell is this woman? Please don't catcall Condes. What? Oh, horror your Yeah, okay, okay. Oh, also, sick nasty, sick nasty green electricity wings. Freaking check. I think we are good to go here. Big man, holler for your women. Oh, hi, John. <laughs> Hey, hey. This woman, that elaborate tramp from the surface of the tome. Oh no, he's shipping himself with the anime girl from the picture. Oh no. Hustles to the side of her de 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 debonair hotshot. Milady, he doffs rationally. Then the man... <laughs> So he's also, like, picking fun of nice guys, too. That's insane. The man brims with intellectual ideas he wouldn't understand. He knows many things about the world and being strong. And yet, he still doesn't know who she is. The goddess of manga, perhaps? It is no matter. She must bow down before her lord, as must you all someday. Goddess of manga, bow down. Uh, hi, John. <laughs> John, please stop him for the love of God. Jonathan Juniper, Jonathan Juniper Egbert. Yes. It's almost time. I jump up and down with sadness. We're saved. <laughs> Here we go. Lamau. Shut up, please, pink sh. Wait, he actually looks kind of <laughs> like the Wansler. He does look like the Wansler. Hold on. <laughs> kind of. Like, kind of, like, has that energy. Yeah, yeah. Kind of once, Lord, and you co you're correct, Pink. Kind of. I've lost it all. I've lost my mind, my mental. It's just no. <laughs> Our Lord has the rights to not to say his Messiah's doings. Uh, what does that mean, Wayrock? Who the hell is this woman? Please don't cut Colcondus. Okay, that's what you meant. John save Yowie Dave, John can't stop him, I'm your bre breath head, can't defeat a true time bro. <laughs> I see. She bows before you, uh, submissively, in a subservient manner. Everything is correct about the situation. You think she's really attractive, and it makes you feel weird physically. And yet, unlike your sister, she knows her place, and has no options or words to remark about it. 
I mean, not to imply that any other aspect of her is like your sister, like being attractive. Wow, what? Did you read into stuff that much? You decide to have too much time on your hands. Do you, you stop thinking about this topic starting us off immediately? I'll, I, I is well and ideal again, without you blurting out unnecessary sexy scandals. It is uh, almost a bit too ideal, you think? Hmm. That's interesting, though, because uh, he's like... He's like, bo he, he both already has like, oh, smut, right? Smut. And he, he, but smut to him was just romance. So like, now that he's getting older in here, I'm guessing that he's feeling some sexual feelings already, like puberty stuff, I'm guessing. And so he's also weirded out by the actual sexual feelings, I guess. I don't know, that, that's my, my guess there, because that's just the kind of ring, rings true of that. Something is amiss. What a question mark. Hey, <laughs> you go in for a closer look at the eyes of the handsome boy's appearance and notice how worrisome the this discrepancy. No, this is all wrong, you frown. These glassy red peepers, lovely though they are, they are, are not your lord's final form. Oh no, his eyes are supposed to flicker about. Interesting. Is this where you come up with that? With the hat flavors mm -hmm. of my loyal frog puppet guys! Legend demands this is a trait of supreme invincibility, owed to a full body union with the clockwork magi magij mag mag jack the clockwork bullcrap. I don't know why that's supposed to happen yet, but maybe we'll find out together with the with the woman. Interesting. So, he does know somehow, definitely not through, through a sky, a cloud mirage, but maybe through, through like one of his monitors. Because like he has, he can see, he could see all of canon through those monitors, right? So he probably could see some parts of his own adventure too, right? Maybe? So yeah, that's interesting that he calls out uh, gaining the, gaining the billardable eyes. Isn't sharp reproduction supposed to be about uh, missing the hatred they feel for their sibling? I suppose. But it's very interesting to see that Caliborn clearly isn't feeling a uh, cosmetic towards this woman. Like, I think we were told that cosmetic is the only quadrant that cherubs are able of feeling. But maybe that's just because that's like the most optimal thing for their species and they're actually capable of more quadrants. Because like, clearly he... Clearly he, do he, he doesn't have like... Hate a lot of the, the, the woman. <laughs> so that's interesting. Hey, a hole, I'm talking to you! Dots. <laughs> Hello there. Hi. Dots. <laughs> Hi, Sebi. <laughs> oh boy. Another instance, stare down. Oh my god. Incredible. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Redraw this. This is from uh, this actually appeared in a couple of places, but I can only recall this tro the standoff, right? I'm pretty sure. <gasps> okay. I'm munching. Sorry, I'm munching. You're fine. Take a good munch before this. Okay, actually, I'm gonna go BRB because I wanna get some uh, water. Yeah, no, that's uh, that makes sense, yeah. It's here, guys. I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make it's time. Off enough. Yeah, it's time. Yeah, it's time. It's time. I've been time. waiting for this. I'm gonna make a little cough now. Okay, I'm back. The Welcome back. Okay, yeah. 
It's Yo, isn't it? You're the guy who bro brought that horrible story with all the fake Daves. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Hi, Sebi. You're behind all of this, aren't you? I feel, I don't know how to, how I know that, but I can just feel it. You're the one who Vriska and her pirate pals are all trying to stop. It was you who put all this into motion in some way. I don't really understand. Which means you're responsible for like a trillion people dying. And the and universe blowing up. And all my friends getting scattered around and acting like idiots. And my, but, and my dad being dead. I, I guess he's like... Blaming everything on him, huh? Okay. Okay, maybe you're not totally responsible for us acting like idiots. Most of that is just on us. But all I... that other bad stuff is your fault somehow, isn't it? I'm gonna kick your arse! Okay, l ladies and gentlemen, we have a hater! <laughs> oh, it's this image! Why? I've seen this image! Listen, clown sharks on Twitter loves this image. I have seen it many posted many time, times by them. <laughs> As you can see, the former ghost of the male hero has come back to haunt me. This is not the first unwelcome intrusion into my private impor impor important affairs. Who, who are you talking to? <laughs> Technically, it will not be his f last either, but it will mark the first time he is forced to pay a toll for his rude teleportation crime. Oh yes, today he will pay with his teeth and with his blood. Um, game over, kid. <laughs> S game over. There it is. Here we Page are. Page 6,900. Page 6,900. Wow. Okay, let me turn off the music. Let me collect myself. Uh, okay, so I know a lot that a lot of people consider this like one of the three big flashes in the in the comic, right? I know that. See, okay, I know that it's not as long as Cascade or Collide. I know that definitely. But I also know that uh, it is considered one of the big ones, one of the like the, the the eventful ones, which is interesting considering that like Caliborn Enter was also pretty freaking eventful. So yeah, but we'll see. It's so s game over. My fab flash. Prepare. Insert plant name here. D -d okay. It goes. Are we ready? He hello, and open up. Hello, welcome to the stream. It's game Jover. Emotionally prepare yourself, craft. This is gonna be rough. I maybe I don't know. Uh, maybe I've been spoiled already on something that happens in here. I don't even know. I've been spoiled on a bunch of things that I don't even know. I couldn't happened. delete that in time, but okay. What? I think before anything else is accidentally spoiled, just maybe start. <laughs> okay, fine. Three. Here we go. Two. One. My voice is killing me because of the colorborn freaking impression. <laughs> I see. He's seeing the mangas. Copyrighted material. <laughs> yep, this is why it's my favorite. Is the music okay? Is the okay? Okay, I'm gonna. I'm, okay, hold on a second. I'm gonna go back. Just... I think it's okay, Craft. I think it's a. Pro it's okay like that. Okay, yeah. sorry. I was just. Well, I just wanted to make sure before we continue. Okay. It was it fine? Was it fine? Was it fine? God, I love Carnival. Yeah, I, I knew that it used Carnival. Unfortunately, I already knew that that, that, that was the, the flash. It's okay, music is fine. Okay, good. So so on, on one bar... That <laughs> Let's go fine. again. Okay, sorry, 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 sorry. I'm just... Ah! This happened with Cascade too, I think. <laughs> yeah, it did. It did. The Yowies. Oh, new express! No, 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 no! Oh, <gasps> hello! He what? The change of, change of like the whole background suddenly. Okay, a lot of different art styles. Hello! Yeah, it's Jackie Chan film. Hi, Kanaya. Oh my God! But Aranya broke her stuff out, I guess. Oh, and Karkat too! Oh my God! Karkat is. Yield now. 
Oh, 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 got it. No, 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 uh, yeah, there were, but like, how is that even? Oh, Jane and Jake dead? Oh, back to them now, okay? <laughs> like, like Jake, but he was not dead, okay. That, whoa, that's his station, a big cow? Can I go for a map? Just dead, Gamzi is dead, but like, how is that even possible? What? He died, she, she just murdered Gamzi. Fucking Dave fighting both PM and Jack, oh my god! Congress. Oh wow! The hell? What? Jack? How is that even possible? Like, what will happen? What? Hero heroic? No, what? Huh? Heroic. And. That can't I, I work! Can't Hello? And everybody, heroic and just. What? Arana is doing something. How does she have telekinesis? How? What the hell? It's now just Arana like versus Condes. Oh my God! What? But like how? Do they both? How do they both have the freaking rust blood power? Oh my God! What? Not Teres- NOT Teresi too! What?! This has to be like, like some weird or fake thing. What?! No, 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 and not the freaking from Make Her Pay- what? This to- the Rose! Roxy! Oh my god! Did you save her? I guess she did. Terezi! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! T uh, um, hi, jo John's just punching him now, and I see a lot of redraws. And he's zapped away. And that's the end? Maybe? And he beat the crap out of Caliborn. Uh, ah. Yeah. Okay. And uh, ego everything else. Ego destroyed, I guess, but also everything else. Click. And that's game over. Yeah, that's game over. Uh, now you know why that's the name. I see. <laughs> okay, so like, God. that was extremely shocking, I, ha, ha, what? I, I don't know what to say, not like, not even me, I, even I don't know what to say. I mean, okay. At least some of this stuff has to be somehow undone, right? We can't just have Rose, Roxy, John, and Theresia, I suppose, left, right? Like, that can't be the case. Oh, well, actually, actually, no. Like, what? That's not how things should go or any... what. There was a lot happening. There were a lot of fights at once, and it was yeah. very cool to witness. But also, why did everybody die? Because they did. Game over. 
B but Johnny J John, you you gotta like zap some of this stuff out of canon, right? You you gotta somehow, I guess. I don't know. Something. Oh, um, the yeah. WV two. WV is alive too. But I guess no. Maybe not actually, because all of the planets freaking collided. <laughs> yeah, pretty much anything is ruined. Uh, Would you like to watch that again? Uh, yes. <laughs> then let's go. Collided a little too early. <laughs> I'm looking at the chat, by the way. There are so many messages. I'm sorry. Hello, Captain Strawberry. Mayor's was when Mayor was on Dave's planet, which collided with Jane, so he is the. Uh, like some of this has to be retconned out, right? John, do something. Do something. Remember, mind control the the Maras. Oh, she was using the Maras still. You're correct, actually, Ria. Yeah. yeah uh... I guess I'll say it now. Uh, we've reached uh, 53 concurrent viewers. What? How? 53, yeah. What? Hi, everyone. Thank you for watching. Thank you so much for watching. What? That's... I did... Is that the biggest we ever had? Yeah. That... Well, it is, yeah. Well, that's... Thank you. <laughs> thank you a lot. Uh, <laughs> thank you, everyone. Thank you for the sub Ogladian. Thank you. Um, oh my god. Again, I made it on time for one of my favorite flashes, AX3, but in a hearty way. Hello, Bark Beast Princess, it's been a while. It's been a bit. Um, well, I guess, I guess you made it on time for me watching it a second time. Uh, do I scroll up? What are, what are people saying? What were people saying? Is this game over? Hussie was on demon time with this one. As everyone die, get his arms. Arana is probably done for. Therese is still alive. Therese is still standing. Roxy, my beloved. Roxy, my goat. Roxy, woo go, Roxy. Geotry is also here. Hi. Genuinely forgot how epic this was. Wow. Oh my god. Heroic dev. What the fuck? Bonotno. Bonotno dev. My goat taking on two back protect car patients. That's why he's the, that freaking guy. But then he dies. Yeah, I saw that as her. Oh no. Kanai is such a bad arse. She is. She truly is. Or was. I. Ugh. Jake. De Jane. Jane. Jake. Uh. Car. Uh, the fact they started with Carcat too, man, cruel. Yeah. That has got to not be real. For now, it's like devastating. We'll see how what what happens in that next. Like goddamn. Okay. Hello, mitochondria, the powerhouse of the cell. I don't see. Carcat, Ka Gamzi, Kanaya, Dave, uh, Jane, Jake are dead. And WV. Yeah. And Jade from before. Yes. But here, in these um, six minutes. Six minutes from what? Six minutes of uh, video. Oh, yeah. is, there, is, is, is this. Is this a six minute? It should minute be around block? six minutes, yeah. Wait, what is? Game over. Oh. I thought no, that's that's weird. Isn't Carnival Carnevale like a different? Hold on, where's music? Carnevale, Carnevale is weird. Carnevale is only four minutes. Yeah, but I flash into ten to edit that. Game over is. I watched it like one hundred and fifty times. Hold on, okay, okay. Let me, let me, let's, let's, let, we, we shall watch it again. We shall watch it again. God damn. Yep. Suffer too. Mitochondria, I honestly expected that you already know what happens. You're being genuinely shocked as a surprise. Okay, I will say here. I, a while ago, saw the shot of Gamzee killing Carcat. 
but I thought that that's, okay. that was like a fake thing, like a, like an alternate timeline thing, maybe. Like I couldn't think that it was actually. If anything, fake. honestly, I thought you would have seen the shot of Kanaya killing Gamzi. Actually, I. You know what? You just ga like gave me like a supreme flashback because I suddenly do remember seeing that too. <laughs> I did not remember for for. But you saying that, I actually do remember seeing it somewhere. Her like like. Nice. Like, tap tap nice. tap 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 up to him. I did not. F I completely forgot up until you said it. So. Yeah. Well. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Watch it. Let's watch again. I suppose I saw the shot of Jane and Jake dying, but Carcat. I didn't know about Carcat. If we had a nickel for every time Kanaya sold someone in half, I would have two nickels, which isn't a lot, but it's weird that it happened twice. Sure, 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 sure. Yeah, chip tree. <laughs> Craft, stop, I'm losing it. Okay, it's okay. Thank you so much. So we got uh, Contis, John, Terezi, Dirk somewhere out there. Roxy, Rose, uh, yeah. And also Union Jack, and also PM and Jack Jack. Back to R. <laughs> The fact that Karkat suppressed vampire swiftness is a short for a short period of time though. Yeah, he was freaking emotionally fueled, dude. The fact that he like ran faster than Kanaya for a second there, god damn. Yeah, that's always impressive to me. Craft in chat in shambles is my favorite. I'm evilly delighted after at the suffer. I'm just confused and ah okay, let's watch it again. <laughs> I'm gonna munch. Horrible. Horrible. The fact that this next up here is so cool. Also, I reckon. Listen, I, I love everything about this. I recognize. I love everything I, about I, I've seen a few of the Paradox Space comics, and I recognize some of the styles as from that. Or, well, mm -hmm. not from, but also seen there. So, the pants Karka has here. My goodness gracious. And, right and the, the fact that it's, the fact that it's the Briss Kakarin Tavros thing, the exact same, except he stabbed him three times. Three. No, it's just two times. One time per uh, hole in his uh, 69 symbol. This this arc, by the way. And Kanaya. The, the Dave fighting these two is so freaking cool, by the way. Yeah. And the, oh dying is not, but the fighting part was cool. And the, fa the, the fact that it switches, like the background here switches, the theme of the browser switches. Like the whole blau browser. It's so too. awesome, yeah. Like, the, the fact that the station is cow shaped is interesting still to me. Cape ripped off. And the freaking. Yeah. The wedgie. <laughs> that, dude. That. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, come on, just come. And Dave goes to. He fought vile, valiant man, valiantly, incredibly valiantly. Heroic. This part. Oh no, Rose is crying, and I didn't even pay attention to that. There's just so much happening. Yeah. Rose crying. Heroic and just. Yeah. Kind of poetic. Oh, and then this. Yup, look at that! Her, her like, like, the, yeah, the, the hand movements, that's freaking wow. I don't know. Drop the. So that's that is three of three of the beta kid planets and only one of the alpha kid planets. By the way, that's been that's, yeah. that's collided. The fact I'm that she just does this to my god! The fact that she just does that! Oh my god! Stabbed right through the chest. Yeah, but still saved by Roxy, which I wonder what, like, if that would be, like, at all possible to, like, salvage? No. 
Moxie. Man. That's so cool. Her kneeling. It's not all over, but. Her kneeling there. Yeah. Those two. Oh my god. Yeah. Aranea is as good as gone. I wonder if, like, the Condes even knows who she's looking at when she's, she sees Aranea. I don't think she's, she was even aware of any mm -hmm. trolls, like, at all, you know, surviving in any way. Mm hmm. And Caliborn is bitten. He is, and it, that's interesting that you you know that that that, that he is, because like I didn't even it didn't even seem like they were using that many of their powers during that brawl. I think that was just Caliborn straight up like not being prepared to, you know, face somebody else who can actually fight like him, you know, because all this time he has yeah. only had underlings and stuff. So that's like that just another player that that's beaten him down. So I think that was just him not being prepared and his ego being beaten down there. Oh boy. How ironic is it that Caliborn is beaten in proximity to some horses? <laughs> okay. I mean, the Void Ring Roxy is, uh, makes her intangible, right? If her rogue Void powers work the same, then she should be fine. Hopefully. Everybody got cooked in this? Has he ain't sparing anyone? Some people were spared. <gasps> I don't know anymore. And Roxy did the Voidy thing. The Voidy thing! Damn. And like non dream ghost Dirk brain ghost no, non brain brain ghost Dirk wasn't even there. He's still out there, out there. Oh my god. Also the pressing fact today was so traumatized about his class pack to which uh, he talked at length with Jade. She he fought basically two Jack Noirs without using time powers. True. Even though he did before. And but now this time he like like actually did not want to. God damn, dude, you're correct actually, because like the the brawl they had with Jack, like J Jade and uh, Jade and Dave basically, right? He was using time clones. So wow. Hello, Bruni, Bruni, we squee. <laughs> Sorry if I said that wrong. Caliborn's face in that last scene is a clever reference to the Homesack fandom when the game over came out. Yeah, I am. I'm, dude. I can't, cannot wait to see some like reactions to this, because because uh, Cascade was like the big flash. There are still like a lot of um, video reactions on YouTube from people from back in back in the day reacting to that. There was like this one video of it that I saw of two girls reacting to it in like a school cafeteria or a school like. Um, I think library maybe and they had to whisper but they were like oh my god oh my god and they were watching Cascade it was so funny they were like recording themselves in a school uh, in a school oh my god that was that was very fun, fun to watch so I, I wonder if there is any any video like that in uh, like from from the olden days you know on YouTube game over reactions are by far the loudest I've ever heard it's so as game over. Snip it into a slam jump. Hello. I don't think I've said said hello to you before. Okay. Um, let's not pick any song yet. Let's just let's just continue normally. Act six. Act six. Intermission three. Yeah. Already yeah. in progress. Ooh, yeah. Quite the baller shot, but also, what does this mean for us? Yeah, you 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 be screeching, screeching. Yeah, you be choking her. Yeah, I see that. What's oh, the ring of life? Yup. Not even gonna kill her. She's just gonna like grab her ring, ring of life, so she becomes a ghost again. These are some very good shots, by the way. Yeah, hands are drawn. Like they're drawn well. super well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Flip, and she's a ghost. Snap. <laughs> she snapped her neck. There. Are, okay, so she did both things, and her revived body is going into the flames. And her, her eyes are becoming blank. Oh my goodness, girl. just. Uh, Interesting. In the bottom right here, you can see a thing. 
Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, I see that. The, the, the watermark, yeah. Who is that supposed to be? Is that supposed to be Mindfang? Is that Mindfang? Yeah, yeah, it is Mindfang, yeah. It's funny. Wait, wait, if you die uh, adjust to death as a ghost, do you just... That's an interesting thought, actually. Is she just not a ghost at this point? Because she flipped the, 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 the ring of life off of her finger, but but it still said just at the end, like as if it was an, like a proper god tier death. So does that mean that Condes just executed a double death? Is that what happened just now? Is, uh, is, 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 is Alpha Aranea like double dead? Don't tell me. I, that, that's a rhetorical question. Oh my goodness gracious. John. John. Oh my god. Oh my god. You missed and so he much. Appears now. You know, this is gonna be probably devastating to him. Yeah? Oh my god. Oh my god. Let me... Okay, this... You know what? I am gonna put on something. Let me see. How about a fire? <laughs> what? Thank you, Wayrock. <laughs> Wayrock says, I wish Condens would double kill me. Stop! <laughs> my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, thank you, Wayrock, thank you. Your your comments are always appreciated. Mm, Firefly, maybe? No! <laughs> what, 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 what? Wayrock, the type of person to spend 50k on a candy animation. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Hide away, hide away from me. <laughs> Wait, okay, have some oh, no. shame. Keep your chin up straight and your back. <laughs> <laughs> I wish Condes would break me like she did those planets. <laughs> no, I'm not verbal ace. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, this is... I don't know if this fits. So that was Firefly, let's see Firefly Cloud. Yes, Firefly Cloud absolutely fits. Firefly Cloud from... Do you have oh, any, anything like maybe somber and a bit sad? Yes, 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 that's what this is. Okay. Absolutely, this is this is that, this is that. This is, this is a somber Good. John theme, yeah, absolutely, okay. <sighs> Man. Playing Firefly Cloud from one year older. Man, that, that was really something. Yeah. What the frick happened here? Blow, bl blow the blow the dust away. What? That's all? No. Caliborn. <laughs> Caliborn. Is that? That's not all of intermission. You. Frick it. Yep. No going back. Caliborn. No. Why? He is just rude like that. Wait, he's... Act 6, Act 6, Act 4. Wait, how, do, how does that... So he's... Interesting. So Caliborn is gonna dream now. As this this self, just just regular, like, 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 kid Caliborn right now. That's... We haven't seen that before, but also... Hold on. How does this look on the map? Is it the far part? Like this? Because this mm -hmm. is... Wait, what? Is this that this that this? No, this is just the panels that were there, like the few panels that were. Yeah, that's there. like five chapters for um, a dozen pages. Yeah, I see that. God's gift to the Yawis. It's because it looks cool like this. Look how how it's like partially the intermission color and partially the act co color here. Act six, act six, act four, dark night of the feelings. Okay. 
sure. Okay. Atin didn't like the direction of my story, so he came and beat me up. What are we seeing right now? Also, noises from you, Luna. Like, typing noises. Not now, please. Hi. This is the worst thing that's ever happened to me. And bear in mind that one time my leg was bitten off and I tragically lost a sister to murder. I... That was... Uh -huh. That was your doing. Tell us about it. Caliborn, that was your doing. As such, I must admit... Is this what his his like is like a per, is this like a personalized dream bubble for himself? To being succumbed to a new low of depressing emotions. He genuinely feels depressed because John didn't like his story and beat him up over it. He genuinely feels depressed over that. What? I did not expect Calab. What? <laughs> By the way, watch out for spoilers in the chat still, please. Both of you. Both Witcher and yes. Luna, if you can. I know that you're not fucking Witcher, but you know, since you're here. Uh, I'm, I'm hearing. I'm, I hear you. Yeah, but I mean, monitor the chat. You have mod status. I am watching, yeah. I am monitoring. Okay, good. To being succumbed to a new low of depressing emotions. As a tortured artist of so much talented promise and intellectual dar daring and cultural magnitude, there can be no doubt. This is my na nadir. What is nadir? My blackest ball before the hall, the dark night of the feelings. I bust my cherub hump for you, people. Day in, day out, I bring home the freaking bacon. <laughs> to you? Do you now? And I accomplish enough premium content to choke your gluttonous candy holes, which serve to barely muffle your noisy cra cravings. For more and for more. And I do this for what? Ungrateful dude. Mm. I know what the crux of this horrible problem is. <laughs> Not the freaking cow head. It is that I am misunderstood. And that the atrocious haters and weak children will say that I am a monster, that I am the biggest bad guy, and that my evil crimes need to be stopped using the tantrum punches. But no, I am just a simple artist. Are you now? Are you? Are you, are you such a, like, an emotionless sick freak as Lord English because of this? Sure, some of their lies have come correct quali so have some correct correct qualities. <laughs> yes, it's true. I hate many things and I want them dead. Like all no non cherubs who aren't me. Okay. <laughs> yes, I mostly want to see every living thing turn extinct in bad ways. Oh, and okay, I've always been a sucker for making funny murders happen. Is that's yeah, that's enough to hate you, I think. Especially if you know you're a person who has to deal with the consequences of your actions. But those are really just hobbies. They don't define me. My true passion is telling stories. Cal drawing. I hugely insist that I walk the path not of a villain, but of an artist. I bleed the blood of a craftsman. I sweat the stuff of a gentle soul, and I weep the tears of a poet. Ah! Caliborn, I cannot take you seriously, I'm sorry. And like any beautiful art poet, who is in a struggle of creative ca calamity, those right angles, man, is he... He's in a dream that is constructed out of his drawing style, and he's drawing with his tablet a 90 degree angle, because that's what he draws with. Okay. I must retreat to my craft. I will fall back to the freaking basics. Form, line, angle, line, more lines, additional angles. Yes. No. Great. Bad. I will regroup. I will rebuild my vision from pixel one. I will reinvent myself as an artist. And again, I will rise. 
Pure art scale. Oh my god, that's that's pretty good actually. That's that that's pretty good count. That is pretty good Caliborn, honestly. Like like seriously, seriously. Like a phoenix from the ashes. Play on words. <laughs> the ar oh the uh, the uh, arses. The arses belong to the haters, of course, which I handed to them personally with my strong bare hands, and so I bide <laughs> my time. Perfecting every aspect of my craft. Polishing while demolishing. Blueprint. Oh See, no! There's the thing. That's the stage. That's the stage that appeared in Calliope's dream. That's no. That is concerning. Jade and Calliope. You should watch out. I take him very seriously. Yeah. <laughs> Caliborn, please shut up. <laughs> Caliborn, do not wake up. Oh my god. Interesting how his dreaming is in the crappy style, but better. Mm hmm. Perfecting every aspect of my craft, polishing while demolishing, honing while owning, and in time you will see my masterpiece. But the thing is... Zilly loot? <laughs> what? Masterpieces don't, come, master, masterpieces don't come cheap. I know I said blah blah, I am a sensitive artist and my soul is, soul is crying, stuff like that. But let's face the crass facts. I am a goddamn businessman, and art costs freaking money. Are you... This is more like a Kickstarter. I see. Project Caliborn's Masterpiece. <laughs> Silly loot. Honk, wee, toot, boing. It's a Kickstarter parody. Wee! Backers 15. Yeah. Oh, your, your felt members. Okay. Pledge th this food. <laughs> um... <laughs> of one zillion goal. One zillion and they're giving it away pretty quickly. And equals mandatory maximum goal. Back this project minimum pledge. A sweet Look. Fif fifty. This currency. What is this currency? I don't know. That's not boon dollars. Uh, candy dollars, I guess. <laughs> fifty for a s real sweet tooth. One hundred for yum yum pasta syrup. 200 for Grape Scott, hee <laughs> hee. 300 for Donut, more like do yes. 400 for Orange You Glad You Pledged. 500 for Banana You Glad You Pledged. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I. Alright, 15 backers. I know the 15th is just a, a little Sebastian, but imagining it is as either uh, is Snowman or Dog Scratch would be so damn funny. Okay. I think we are. Uh. Like, avoiding, like, talking about something here, or at least I, I forgot about it. Gamzi died there, but eventually he had to, like, time travel back to the time where the meteor was making it to, er, to Earth B, so that he could be with Caliborn eventually. So, like, how does that work? I don't know. <laughs> and so I will fee need you to plunge your grubby fists. <laughs> okay. All of them are donating. Hi, die, hi, trace, house, hi, stitch, hi, eggs, hi, uh, itchy, hi, doze, hi, clover. And Gamzee. Okay, so the 15th one is Gamzee. So yeah, exactly. Like, Gamzee is right here. This is a non-dead Gamzee. What is happening with this? Our Mirful Messiah is just that good and said, nah, he'd win. <coughs> Isn't that from before? I always thought that it should, who has to be like after. I don't know. I am back. I had. I'm back. I had to wake up. Kiki Goobs Lamau. <laughs> Is Kiki Goobs gonna be joining? Like he eventually time traveled to make Union Jack British, <laughs> and I think the takes the current time. See? in the future i mean yeah okay but like how would he go back from caliborn's uh, place to uh the session right like how how would he go from caliborn's uh, session back to the you know the 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 the, the, the alpha human session how hmm. oh i hope they join Tell them you ju you just missed game over, sucker. 
Farf down your money pockets and donate generously to the next and greatest act of homosac. You won't be disappointed. As we speak, my closest friends and allies are digging deep and chipping in. Totally optionally. Or else... Totally optionally or else. The savvy cash giver will also be ple pleased to know... Public address deposit verify. Ha ha hi hi hoo ha. Private key. Is this a currency he made up himself? That I am graciously accepting Calcoin. Okay, it's Calcoins. The bleeding edge of modern Im imaginary currency, which I recently made up with my own computer, uh, with my own computer, and can confidently claim to be la to largely understand. Please stand by, very impatient, impatiently. Through the next lengthy garbage of not important stuff, I will be using lots of fancy software money to craft my swan song. Tune in next time on Homosac for the thrilling and artistically unbelievable conclusion of Homosac. S by forever. Almost. So is this... Uh, holy crap, so is this what... Yeah, this is like all... Act 6, Act 6, Act 4 is already ending too. I guess we're really playing with the length of the chapters here. So like we're after this, yep. if the next intermission is gonna be per proper length, it's gonna be intermission four, then act five, then intermission five. And then you know what? And then act six, act six, act six, which will probably be collide. So I'm probably counting on the, all of those segments I just mentioned being like actually, you know, properly, uh, you know, le pro proper length, you know? Like this, mm -hmm. or, or, or this. Or this. Or even Act 5, Act 2. Why, why, how the, why, why the heck not? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe, 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 maybe I'm dreaming too big there. What if he's just walking around as two barred halves? Hmm? Ever considered that? Yeah, we, you, you are correct. We are, we, we are only seeing one half of him here. <laughs> he might be chopped in half. <laughs> Panel redraw of cans and quarters holding Cal. Wait, where? When did cans and quad? Uh, what? When did that happen? When did quarters qu quarters hold cow? non zilliable tokens. Oh my god, <laughs> cryptocurrency. Okay, let me see. S by forever almost. Oh my god, another zilly song. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's this called? <laughs> I need to see. All features. Gimme. S game over car. Doesn't even have a freaking <laughs> credit on this fa- Okay. Act 6. Act 6. Intermission 4. Oh, more planets collided than we realized. Oh my gosh. Land of Light and Rain, Land of Frost and Frogs, uh, this is Land of Crypts and Helium, Land of the pff, Heat and Clockwork, Land of... Land of Debris and Destruction. Mm, maybe. Uh, this is Land of... Hold on, what was Dirk's land called? This is Lomax, this is Land of Misogyny and Xenophobia, obviously the, the, the official name, but... Uh, <laughs> what was his called? Xeno... No, 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 no. Uh, I, I forget Dirk's land's name, god damn it. And then we have py py Same. pyramids and uh, pyramids and neon, I think. Yeah, py or neon. No, pyramids and neon. And then we have wind and shade, obviously. Prospect's Only John and Roxy's planets yeah. are still intact. Prospect is still destroyed, and Durs is, I guess, looking good. Good enough. There probably still is a pretty big hole in it. And I would was need to remind you, there is no Skya to put in the middle anymore. You're co Wait, you're right, the entirety of Sky was destroyed, I just now realized that, what? The battlefield is useless! There is nothing left to do. What? Ha! But... Tombs and Krypton, thank you, Egg is on fire. No, yeah, th there is go Okay, John has got to, like, hone his freaking like... Redconning powers, right? That's got to happen. Because, like, you can't just do that. 
What? Okay, Sky is gone, but English is still around. I told you, Arane, I told you, dog. <laughs> what? Yeah. I told you about the timelines. Wow. Yeah. I mean, uh, all right then. A6, A6, I4. Oh. This is what Stardust looks like now? Did it get this bad? Also, do, will we see the giant floating candy corn anywhere? <laughs> okay, let me, let me put fire, fire, fly Cloud back on. Hey John. Oh, uh, this these next ah! few panels are my some of my favorites of the comic. Yeah, there there is the giant candy corn. Yeah, there it is. Oh, the sense of scale here is impeccable. Wow, A panorama. Jade's home. <laughs> John is flying. An echidna statue. Or is that echidna herself? Like, no, that, that has to be a statue. Whoa. We saw this! We, we saw this in, like, um... Uh, inside of the Sunslammer flash, but, like, it was very, very far away. Mm -hmm. Echidna statue. Oh. Yeah, that sure is Jade in the Rose's Land. Wow. I don't know. Okay, but oh my gosh, that is so cool. Except how devastatingly sad it is. It is that looks so astonishing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Arana cooked so hard the kitchen burned down. Sure did. Peak ship content. Stop. I mean, I guess. We'll see. Oh, down. I guess it's space, right? Rose's yeah. house. Rose's house. Oh no. Yeah, it's the observatory. Jane's land. All of the trickster plants, Me. the balloons, <laughs> Zazarpan. Oh my god. Yeah, and here is Jane's land and Dave's land. Oh, is John going somewhere on, on, on Land of Heat and Quark now? Oh, Jade. oh my gosh. I'm gonna make the music a little louder. I should be do doing this probably a little faster, but god, that is so beautiful. No, 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 it's fine, it's fine. You, you should take in the beauty, yeah. Stonehenge is on freaking low hack since when? Uh, 3,000 years ago? <laughs> Duh. Globs of lava and the Oh Jake Jake and Dirk Oh my god I'm going down again Oh, that's a pretty tall tower there. Whoa. These freaking like broken towers floating in space, curling like snakes. This is such cool imagery. Yeah. And it's all stock photos too. <laughs> oh my god. I, I, I like the little subtle like addition of the lighting there. <laughs> Do you think these were panels that Hasi did like in the inside of the break too? Oh, did what? Do you think these are panels that Hasi did inside of the break too, like during the break? 
Probably. Stat At least, you know, a good portion of them. Statue of Yaldabaoth there. But but it has no face for some reason. Oh, never mind, it does. I mean, it was a really long break, but it's not like he did nothing. No, yeah, absolutely. There were a lot of big things coming up in there's the comic, probably, and he just there, took the time to work on probably them. probably an, an Okay, He's just an announcing paradox space here, because this is Young Reader Stan's novel webcomic. I'm gonna read these later. But mm -hmm. there, there, was, there was like a post introducing the new year still giga paused yeah because this is still giga paused this is the four the year four mega pause yeah that's that's when he announced it oh hey cool stuff art did you know homestuck has heart yes oh, oh. <laughs> this is is this only when the the, the, the third the, the third original book came out 2013, like after yeah. all of those, and the final problem stuff book. Wow, interesting. Sepulchre dude, yeah, my man. Giga pause commands. Oh, this this. Oh, that's weird. That's weird. We un we unlocked Namco High, but now Namco High like before this new sp news post. That's weird. Yeah, not oh. everything is perfectly put in place. Yeah. <laughs> Corrupted Jane hoodie. Mm -hmm. Concert plushies. Whoa, that's cool. <laughs> and I'm just I'm just looking at the new new, new stuff now. That's like there's like a whole year here. De yep. Definitely gonna re 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 read all of these news posts later. There was a, a, a like when I was reading the the artist list on 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 this game. There were quite a lot of names that, that I actually rec recognized. Yeah, like this person. Then this person make um, cucumber quest. You should you should know this right, yeah, Azur. Cucumber Quest. Yeah, Cucumber Quest is like a comic that uh, is apparently very cool. Mm. Tyson Hess, by the way, of <laughs> of 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 uh, Sonic fame. Damn. J Cuc yes, Cucumber Quest, yes, they did. GG, 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 my lord and savior, their art is like my bible. Cool. This is the... Oh, so, so, it, on the anniversary, um, Paradox Space was announced. Giga almost unpaused, probably. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense, because September and then October. That was pretty close at that point. Maybe since Halloween's coming to a petition, but the Yeah, okay. Released- he released an actual horse calendar- okay. Did- what? Sure, okay. <laughs> Whatever, man. I'm gonna read all of those news posts at another time. Cool. Wonder how the denizens are doing right now. <gasps> actual Dirk! Actual- You were saying it? Actual Dirk! Yep. Actual That's Dirk! Dark. Actual Dirk! Non-brain goes to Dirk. Oh my god. This is gonna be a conversation. Yes. I'm gonna make it a little less loud. Uh, hey there. Are, are you Davis bro? Uh, oh no. It must, dude, it must feel horrible to like only come back now and all of this has happened in your absence. Like, god damn. I love the Paradox Space comics. We we'll read them on stream at some point, as well as play the Homestuck, uh, the Homestuck routes on, in, in Namco High. We're, we're, we'll do that. Hey, did you hear me? Where is everyone? Uh, I'm John, by the way. John. Oh boy. Could you please just leave me alone? Oh no. What? Why? I, I don't understand. Do you know what happened here? Yeah. Oh boy, this again. <laughs> looking, looking in the reflection of his shades. Yeah. I 
failed. Oh no, Dirk! Don't blame yourself! Oh my god! You were, you were literally out of the picture! No! Uh oh. Stardust? John, blow it away! What's happening? J John, use your windy. What's going on? There's so much. Yeah. Blow the blow the stardust away. Well, I think there's too much, you know. Like maybe, that's Roxy and Row. So, listen, I saw the orange and I saw the blue and I for some reason thought this was Vriska and her god tier wings. I was <laughs> I had like a mini heart attack. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Um The Lalons over here. Oh. Yeah, he's he's flying to one towards them, yeah. Following them to one of the only plants that are left currently. Whoa. That's a That's a statue of her denizen. What's what's her denizen's name? Actually, I'm gonna look it up because I wanna remember, but I don't wanna like actually look look for the look for her desktop because <laughs> that would take t take out take out too much. So hold on, um, land of pyramids and neon denizen. Okay, frick, land of pyramids and neon. Nyx. Oh! Nyx. Goddess of the night. Okay. Interesting. This looks so cool, by the way. This all looks awesome. Ah, John. Oh. So yeah, I, I don't think... I don't think Rose is coming back from this. Oh, Roxy. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> oh boy. Oh no. Yeah. Is 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 the yeah. is the realization setting in? What happened to Rose? Oh. Luna, it's your Mom? I got I need to go forward to this page. But don't you don't you have the stream? Yeah, but it's a bit blurry, so the text is hard to read. Okay. Mom, please wake up. It's me, your um daughter kinda. Please don't die. Uh Rose? Oh. What? What? Huh? That's... Hmm? What is happening? Her... Uh, that's Rose's she eyes opening. She's opening her eye. Oh. I guess she's alive still somehow? I mean, she's a dire streamer. That should have been just... Yeah. I don't think what she did was... I... No. You... Ju just and heroic deaths are not based on if whether you're a prospect or a dirty dreamer, dude. That's true. That's true. What? Why did you think that? Uh, my brain had a fart. My brain had a fart. Okay. It's fair. That's fair. Post game okay. over is so good. Love the sadness and suffer. Okay, sure. I. Pfft. Yeah. <laughs> what? What happened to me? The witch got you. We were fork, but you're gonna be okay. Oh, that's nice. <coughs> Maybe you uh, shouldn't try to talk now. You saved me, didn't you? Uh. Thanks, but she's gone, isn't she? For good, I mean. 
Mm -hmm. I saw her die, and it's a shame how. <coughs> it's a shame that I'll never even go to tell her I love her. Oh. Did you never? Did you seriously never say that to Kanaya? Like you, you guys kissed and. You still didn't say those words? That's... Kanaya. Sad. But you too, mom. What? No. You too. Wait, no, is she dying for realsies? That should... That should not, like, be either just or heroic, right? You should wake up soon. What? That's not... No. 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 That's... No. You... But like no, what? But what, how is the what? How though? Like exact my exactly my question. Exactly my question. What? That's a stretch. No, that's bullcrap. Yo, what I am saying? What? R.I.P. Rose. It's so first emotionally that she never got. She never told her GF she uh, she kissed that she loves her. God damn, Jane. Also, hi, Jane. Oh my God. What? Yeah? Yeah! Yeah! I would... As she... I'm sorry. I got here too late to do anything. Because as far as I may think I've come, I still don't know what I'm doing. Dave's bro is in the, in the, in the funny pants... <laughs> Dave's bro in the funny pants was right. But not about himself. I was the one who let everybody down. I'm the failure. It's me. Oh. You saw Dirk? Where is he? He was back there, uh, floating near all the exploded planets. He told me to leave him alone, so I did. And now he's stuck somewhere inside all of those crappy glitches, which just keep getting worse. Do you think you can get him out? He's like... My only friend wasn't that wasn't died yet. Oh my god. I, I don't know. I have been able to clean up some glitches here and there, but they're everywhere now. It's like the whole universe is corrupted. Or more than just the universe, you know what I mean. There is no way I can use my windy powers to blow it all away anymore. Luna wind like breath noises on your mic. How? I don't know okay. how. Okay. You know what I mean. There is no way I can use my windy powers to blow it all away anymore. And even if I did, then what? Everything has gotten so freaked up. Yeah. Huh. Oh no. I'm the failure, it's me. God damn it, Hasi, a Sparge reference in this scene, really? I recognized it, but I didn't want to say anything. And they're sitting now. Poor Rouse. She was always too brave for her own good. This was is all exactly what happened last time. Last time? Um, it was years ago. When Jack killed our parents. And we tried to fight him, but we weren't strong enough to face him yet. So he killed her. But at least that time, I could bring her back to life. How? Uh, just like using a certain method that is not an option anymore. <laughs> yeah. Uh... You require a separate dream body for that, you do. That's the weird thing about this for me. I'm sitting here, looking at my dead friend, and it's really sad, but at the same time, all of this has already happened before. The death and tragedy and stuff, getting painted into the corner of yet another unwinnable situation. It keeps happening. And I don't know how to stop it. Yeah, me neither. But we can't give up, right? I mean, we've all been in worse situations and gotten out of those, right? Uh, have we really? Well, um, no, I guess we haven't. I guess this is like, this like may be quite literally the worst thing that's ever happened. I mean, not to put too fine a point on ranking crappy things, but this is about as an unbelievably crappy as it gets. I keep thinking about what I could have done to... Or what well, I still could do if I only... If somehow I could learn to control this 
or like even better understand this this stupid zappy red Connie, whatever it is, blah. John, yo, chill. Chill. Yes, maybe we should try to like not worry about crap so much anymore. I heard your voice, Craft. You thought of Spatch, didn't you? I can hear it. My eyes see all. Are your eyes in your ears? Also, yes. It keeps happening. Stare. Unfortunately, yes. <laughs> this is unequivocally the worst situation in all of this comic, and all of humanity literally got atomized. Ugh. Uh, okay. Why not? There are so many problems. I know. I know all about the problems. And we are both way brave and all. I'm sure between us we proved that hella many times already. But man, I never wanted anything more than to meet my mom. To meet Rose, I mean. And to just be with her and talk. And try to understand this bond I felt like we always had without ever knowing each other. I kept getting so close, dreaming about her, waking up too soon. And finally, the last time I woke up was just in time to see her die. Mm. It's like the witch was holding it just long enough for the dream to feel like a real possibility before taking it away. Then you take that ultra sad thing and pile on all the other brutal ma manure raining down on this epic crap charade. And I've got to say, John, this is starting to feel an awful lot like the end. The end? Yeah, whatever the end of the road feels like, it has gotta feel like this. Maybe we should just admit to ourselves this is really what it's like when you find yourself in a timeline where everything went wrong. And you know it means you're doomed. And the only thing left to do is face the fact you have to ride it out into nothingness. Stop worrying so much and try to let it go. You mean like... Uh, what do you mean? <clears throat> Sorry, give me a second. Give me a second too, cause I'm... yeah. Not an hour Okay, I'm sorry, I'm back. <laughs> my and I've got my dinner. Alright. Okay, I mean, accept that we lost. Admit that the people who wanted to be with the life you've always wanted, it was never gonna happen. Except maybe in the afterlife. Our friends are there. Callie's there. My mom is there. Why shouldn't we be there too? Why not just let the Doom timeline work its gloomy magics and slip away into nothing with the rest of this mess? Oh my gosh, so so she is assuming at this point that this is a doomed timeline. Oh my gosh. Uh, oh my gosh. Yeah. The way that therapy, yep, that's the that's therapy, all right. Those are her wings. I recognize the Pachu wings. Okay, then, yep. Uh, hi there. Don't die from that. Ouch. Can you not die from that, please? Do you? Oh my god, she's going. Don't drop dead like Rose, please. Terezi? Wow, are you okay? Uh... Uh... Doof. Okay, she's uh, upset about something, definitely. Hi. Fix this! 
Ah. Oh, hi, hi Jade and Calliope. So, def she's definitely talking about this because she heard John talk to, you know, Terezi and Rose about the Redcon powers. So, Roxy is suggesting to give up here. Terezi is not feeling like giving up, definitely. <laughs> oh boy, okay. Yeah. We'll see how hard that goes. Let's go back to Green Lolly for this. Hey, hey, can you uh, voice Jade with me while I quickly eat dinner? Okay. Thank you. So... Oh. A stage of uh, Hell Murder Island, huh? With Beck. With a Be Beck standee. That's odd, right? Like, because we know that this was made by Caliborn now, somehow. Oh, <laughs> Jade, has a Jade has a troll now! Oh my god! She has been everything during this comic now. Gamzi took like, uh, hold on, how many? How much is that? 53 million, 69,240 Caliborn bullets. Can Terezi do that? I. Maybe she, she, she was down with the clown for long enough to have that the power. Rose got stabbed once, died Terezi, got stabbed and stabbed and stabbed and lived. I don't know, maybe she's just built different, man. Fix this! Yeah. Terezi Peak, true. This was your home? Mm-hmm. Well, sort of. It looked before uh, more realistic than when I lived here. <laughs> Look at her. There's ver very simple horns. Ah, yes, I recognize it now. It's just like Jake's home, but uh, with less foliage. Foliage? Oh, uh, on his earth, mm, these hills were covered in trees. It's it, in yours, I suppose. Uh, uh, there was more care given to landscaping. Ha! <laughs> huh. That's interesting. <laughs> is it? Um, I'm more not sure what the, what it is particularly. <laughs> yeah, I guess not. But it is uh, very nice here, even if it it is only a stylistic approximation of your home. Pity there are no actual trees, though. I have never actually seen one. You haven't? Come to think of it, I have never even seen a plant. <laughs> Plenty of meat, though. Uh, meat was left for us in great supply. Candy, too. By, but nary a, pl a plant for as far as an eye can could see. Must have been left by Gamzee, right? Where the hell did he get meat and candy in that quantity from? That sounds terrible. When I was a kid, I grew up with plants only, but I was very lucky. I guess I took all the nice things about my life um, on this island for granted. I even had my own garden where I grew flowers and vegetables and fruits and such. And that is all I ever ate, the things I grew myself. Ooh! But I will admit, not to having developed a taste for meat since becoming a dog. <laughs> meat is very good. For all the complaints I might have about my childhood, Near exclusive sustenance upon, upon raw flesh is not one, but then I am sure that uh, that comes with the territory of being a monster. Huh? Who? Oh. I didn't mean to change the subject. Uh, but please tell me about your garden. This is nice. A jade style approximation of the garden. Oh, that's cute. Uh, she doesn't know that she's dead yet. That's why she had has pupils. Oh yeah, but that. so oh yeah. So Azura was questioning that. No, yeah, because that's uh, that is something that uh, Calliope specifically mentioned. I think. Yeah. She did doesn't didn't uh, doesn't remember how she died more specifically because she's like not sure if she's asleep or dead. So yeah, that that's why that's why the eyes are still as they are. Bye, Wayrock. I love these two so much. Their interactions are definitely very pleasant. <clears throat> my grandpa set it up for me in the atrium. I would spend hours tending to my plants and playing music for them. It was one of the places where I was the happiest I can remember being. I miss that garden. What happened to it? It blew up. And then I built my house way up and on top of where it used to be. In the years since that happened, I thought about rebuilding it. As a way to pass the time on my long, long, lonely, long, lonely journey. 
lonely, sorry. But I was too depressed to know to know to grow anything. Hmm, <laughs> yes, I believe I can sympathize. What sort of place did you grow up uh, in that didn't have plants? Was it a desert? Of sorts, yes. It was Earth, actually. Huh? <laughs> My Earth was much less hospitable toward life than yours. I am sure I was the only living thing left on the planet. That sounds lonely. It was. But didn't you say meat was left for us earlier? <laughs> oh. Was someone else there? Yes, uh, technically, but he was only there while I slept. Who? My brother. Oh, I had a brother too. It's funny, we keep discovering ways that we are alike. Yes, but not so much in this way. For one thing, you and your brother never detested each other, to my knowledge. Yeah. Oh, Calliope's memory. <laughs> Special stardust over there, oh my god. Even in her memory, she is chained to the wall. Ah, uh, sad existence. Also, you and he spent most of your lives apart. To you, I'm sure he, it, it seemed a cruelty to grow up divided. But to me, that would have been a great li liberty. This is where you and your brother lived? <sighs> What's she looking at? Cherub tooth. How does Calliope have that in her memory? This was this was spat out by Cal Caliborn after she was dead. Cali. When you said you were a monster, what did you mean? Were you just being hard on yourself or did you mean that literally? Well, you know, if you think about it, you could define a troll as a monster. No, I was being rather literal about my true appearance. I see. And your brother looks like the same way too, I take it? Yes. We look identical, though we, he, has, he was surely more a monster than I. He still is. Was this his tooth? Yes. It was once mine as well, but that is a topic which would require some elaboration. To tell you the truth, I would rather not talk about my brother or anything from my past, really. Dwelling on it for long makes me feel very anxious. That's okay. We don't have to talk about it. It's just seeing this tooth and listening to your voice. I think I'm finally starting to remember something. Oh, what do you remember? I remember you. Me? Yes. I'm quite sure now that I now that we met once before while I was asleep, it wasn't you, and yet it was you, and yet it wasn't. Do you mean you to say you saw my true appearance? I think so. E God, when? Jade, when? I hope I didn't frighten you. I was a little scared of at first, actually, but it was not so much because of what you looked like. Who? Your voice was the same, and I can tell now that you are basically the same person she was, yet you seem so different. Okay, so we're talking about the old Kali. So she's real, she's out there, and Jade has seen her. She just forgot. Interesting. We need a space player to get together, Jade, Kanaya, and Kali in the forum. Dream blunt rotation, <laughs> oh my god. We need a time player, get together Dave Aradia Caliborn and the Maraca Nightmare Blunt okay, look, rotation. Oh my god, does her. Remove Caliborn from that group and Dave would not be walking out of that room as a guy. Jane, what? <laughs> Jane, what? A conversation between Dave, Caliborn, and Damara would certainly be a nightmare. I don't... Okay, Caliborn, yes. If our idea was there instead of Caliborn, I think it would be awesome, awesome sauce. <laughs> so much more serious. And you were a god tier. What do you think it means, Callie? If that was you, but not quite you, then who was it? That was a version of myself I could have become, but for whatever reason I did not. She was the one I am supposed to find, but it would seem you found her first. I see. An alternate universe version of yourself? Yes. The version who was able to defeat my brother before I could commit... before he could commit his mayhem. 
That makes sense. No wonder she was so, well... No offense to her, but you were much friendlier. I was that bad, was I? Or, um, she? Not really. It was not long before, uh, at all before I could tell she was good. Actually, the more I think about it, the more I'm starting to remember um, about the, com the encounter. She had a lot to say. What did she tell you? She mainly told me stories. Who? Oh. She seemed to really uh, like te telling stories. So I think your personality must, must have been in there somewhere. You don't, uh, by any chance. You want to know if I remember any? Yes, it's been co it's been coming back to me a little by little. I think I, I can retell some of them. <laughs> hey, I have an idea. Why don't you help me? How? Do you have anything to write on? A pad of paper or such? I think so. One moment. <laughs> the freaking Till Death book. Oh, she she looks so cute here. Taking a look at the chat. <laughs> How's this? Perfect. Okay, I will write the words and you can draw the pictures. Oh, what a good idea! Yes. Okay, where do I begin? Where to begin? If I recall, the first story was about how she defeated her brother, but I don't remember much about that one. And maybe you don't even want to hear a story that was that has to do with him? That would be the way in which she and I differ. In my story, it was the other way around. Hmm. That makes sense. The rest of her stories, I think, were meant to account for the differences in uh, the way her life went. Oh, how interesting! Now I am very curious. So she went on to the on to tell another story, not one about your brother, but one about mine. It already sounds like a much more pleasant story. Well, not exactly. A story old Calliope told about John. What? This is the story about how he died. What? When? That's. So weird, what? What? I am so confused. Interesting how Caliborn is an artist and Big Quotes and Calliope is a storyteller. She's, a, she's also an artist though. They are both cutie pies. This is true. <laughs> 7k pages of wackiness. Oh yeah. At some point we reached 7k. Hold on. Let me see which page that is. Where's 7k? Oh. Oh, sorry. Not pa without page. <laughs> this was 7k. Damn. Oh yeah, I completely missed it. I was thinking about it too. Happy 7,000. Happy 7,000. We only got 1,000 left. My god. Bes uh, besides, I believe that till death to be the main element of code structure to spur the game. Like, all key events are tied to something dying, such as God Tears Reckoning and such. That's the thing, though, because Spurb itself is, like, a game designed for you to interface with the with the world, with, with an Incipisphere. But the Incipisphere itself exists, like, um, outside of the game. It's not that related, like, it just is, you know? So I don't think it, it was coded by anyone, really. It just exists because... It, in, in CP spheres exist just because they exist, you know? Exactly three years, yes. None of which were fabricated by me for years of streaming. <laughs> How was it? Yeah, uh, obviously, three years, wow. Insane. Uh, it was... Uh, horrible. <laughs> I don't know. The powers you were talking about earlier. Uh-huh. Do not harm me, Egbert. Okay, let me... Okay, actually. How about Therese's Pester Quest theme? 
How about that? I think it fits. Sounds good. Fits enough. I can go back to voicing right away. Yes, yes, yes. I have noticed. So this is, uh, yeah, this is by James Roach. Every, pretty much every original song in Pester Quest is by James Roach, right? Because like all of the all of the all, all of the ones that aren't by James Roach are taken from other albums. Anyway. You look like an idiot, but we both know you are no fool. <laughs> hey. <laughs> I know I need to catch up with this too. Okay. Seventy twenty-two. Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't argue with her, John. She's all bloody. She clearly means business. You are like kind of distant. Is are you like uh, further away oh, from your oh. microphone? I pulled my mic up earlier. Sorry. Okay. okay, now it should be better. Okay. Can you reset the lines or...? Yeah. I wouldn't argue with her, John. She's all bloody and she clearly means business. Uh, okay, you're right. Yes, there is you. I agree to the fact that, that I look like an idiot. Primarily because you seem badly in wounded and angry. Are you sure you're okay? SHUT UP! Ugh. On Rose's Rainbow Candy Planet, you appeared and said you had the ability to change things, to alter history without dooming the timeline. Oh, yeah. The thing with that is, um, wait a minute, Terezi, are those Jade's shoes? <laughs> um, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Maybe, maybe, yes. Yes as in yes, or yes as in maybe. Yes as in maybe. Terezi, why are you wearing Jade's shoes? <laughs> where's, where's Jade? Jade's dead. Well, goddammit. <laughs> oh man, not Jade too. Are you sure? Yes, John. You mean like dead, dead. Everybody's dead, John. Everybody, even Dave, he's dead, John. Everybody's dead. Everybody is dead, John. So, Jade, Dave, Karkat, they're all... Even the cute mayor guy who Dave loves so much? John, let's not do this. Damn it. Well, did you actually take Jade's pul uh, pulse? You know, she does like to sleep a lot. I sniffed both her and Dave's poignantly overlapping torsos very carefully for a human pose. Alas, I found none. Hmm. Okay, oh. And then you decided to take her shoes. Yes. <laughs> and you thought that was an appropriate thing to do? Why exactly? John, her shoes were red, sparkly, and delicious. I am only flesh and blood. <laughs> ah. You are such a weirdo! Why are all the troll girls so weird? Every single one I have met is some kind of depraved lunatic. All the troll boys I have met are just lame weenies though! <laughs> okay. Well, except for Karkat. Karkat was great. May he rest in peace. Don't freaking say that! What? He is not dead! But you just said- I mean, he doesn't have to be! I did not come here to behave in the repugnant attitude of a de de defeatist dork. I came here to force said dork to use his incredible and totally underappreciated uh, unprecedented powers to set everything right, even if it means stabbing him until he complies. Okay. You don't need- we need to stab me, really. Don't you think I want to? He- we just lost everyone we cared about. Of course I want to go back and change things. I just have no idea how. And that is not my problem. I just- uh, Just as la a lack of stylish gay gemstone studded footwear is also not my problem as of precisely today. These things are your problems to solve. Both the, the pitiable, pitiable lack of command over your zappy power, prowess, as well as the grotesque pair of banana loaf loafers on your feet. Uh, I freaking tr hate troll girls! <laughs> My god. John. Yeah. Where did Rose go? What? 
Have you ever seen your Denizen? I swear to God, I just got the biggest full body chills from head to toe. I am not kidding. I am tearing up. Is, is it? Is what I think is happening is happening? Are they gonna do, actually do their planet quests? Oh my god! Oh my god! I am so actually excited. You have no idea. Uh, that's great. That's great. No. This is great. Well, well no, but it's it's awful, but it's great. <laughs> I almost did it once. What happened? I was tricked into going to see him early by a blind prankstress <laughs> who shall remain nameless. I'm talking about you with a rising pie rope. <laughs> 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 <coughs> that sounded like a freaking villager noise. <laughs> <laughs> but at the last minute, I was talked out of it by a pal from the future. I, w uh, I wasn't ready to see him yet. I would have died if I did. Okay, but like, what if you are now? What if I'm what? What if I'm what? Ready. I mean, if now's not at my time, then when even would be? Yeah, baby. I guess you have a point. Would that actually accomplish anything, though? Yeah, I don't know, man. I'm just spitballing here. You're supposed to be these ginormous monsters that you either fight or you listen to the riddles and they help solve all your problems or something. <laughs> all your problems, yeah. All your you have experience with solving all of your problems. <laughs> Can you continue, please. Sorry. I did. Aren't they? Okay. Aren't they? Uh, more or less. I think the purpose is a bit more mysterious than that, and I guess more, like, majestic? <laughs> majestic? I don't know. I'm probably not the best guy to ask about denizens. Jade made hers, but she's, uh... A sprite could explain it better than me. Didn't you ever talk to your sprite about them? Okay, so... That's something that I didn't think of. All of the, mm, like, sprites that were gathered on Dirk's planet... Did they die? Can sprites die like that? Or did they manage to like teleport slash fly away? I'm concerned for them now. I did not even think that they could be dead. Oh, mm -mm. nah. Yeah, and Fafeta never talked much about that stuff. We mainly traded lame puns and talked about our crappy love lives. You did? Wow. What kind of sprite did you even have? Oh my god. John, not the time. Mm -hmm. Uh, never mind. I did not mean to touch <clears throat> upon yet another sad subject. Anyway, maybe you're right, and my denizen could help me with these problems. But at the same time, there are so many problems. Even, uh, even if I learned to control my powers better, we would still have to deal with all this glitchy bullcrap. I could zap around and fix everything, but if it's all still garbled, how would I even know if it was fixed? Maybe you are right, Roxy. What if... It's all too much to overcome this time, even for Typhius. I have had heard enough. John, you have slandered our troll males as weenies. And while I could not possibly dispute this characterization... <laughs> <laughs> Love you, Terezi. Today, I listen to excuses from none other than the supreme weenie himself. Take that! <laughs> 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 You will go see your denizen at once. Ask him to help you understand your powers and accept whatever price he demands. This is not negotiable. God, all right. I, c I was going to agree to go see him anyway. Can't a guy just think out loud a bit before making a big decision? No. Wow. Okay. My bad, I guess. <laughs> yes, stop thinking. You have always been terrible at it. <laughs> Leave the mind to me. <laughs> My god, Terezi. Now is like really her time, huh? Like, I'm enjoying this dialogue a lot. Fine, then I guess it's settled. I will go to Lois and see my Denizen. But what will you guys do? I probably nothing. Nothing? If you are successful, then we ha will stop existing. I doubt it will be like having to live the rest of your lives in a doomed timeline. Hmm. Technically, that is what we are doing right now. I presume that since you have been 
uh, endowed with the ability to re rewrite causality, not unlike the mechanism behind the scratch, everything as it is now will simply cease to be. Ow. Hmm. What? I mean, even though everything in this timeline is about as crappy as it gets, that still seems kind of sad. That's just and, like so interesting that Terezi is taking this stance, right? Because as we re remember, when uh, Dave Sprite, right, was leaving uh, Chris Rose um, after those months, they were like super concerned about not existing anymore. While Terezi is like, oh, if I stop existing, that's fine. If the real Terezi will eventually like, you know, still live, that will be me, right? Like, even if, if she doesn't think, oh, oh, she doesn't know if she'll share, share the memories or whatever. Nothing like that. She still, like, is very much up to mm -hmm. this for this. Kind of, you know, interesting, cha yeah. like, difference in approach, you know? She's just, oh, things are bad, things could be better. I don't care if I remember or I don't remember or whatever. If I need this to be fixed. Huh. Leave the mind work to me, said the seer of mind. Yes, she did. Exactly. Just another scene meant to show Terezi is the best troll. Wow. When Terezi said take that, I made that up. I made that up. She didn't say it. I did. <laughs> I did say Terezi is my favorite troll. You did? I don't remember that. Yeah, a long time ago. Freak yeah, quest time. We haven't seen a sprite die outside of self-explosions, but Dave sprite survived back to a... True, but also there was Icor leaking out of his gut, so... Uh. Sorry, uh, not Icor. Not whatever. Blah? Game mechanics fans like me cheer cheering, they're thinking of doing the quests. Yes, but that is exactly... that. Like, exactly, I have wanted to know, like, these, like, base mechanics of Spurb and stuff for so freaking long. Like, ac like, genuinely actually so long. The fact that we are actually getting close to it is amazing to me. And just saying... Hold on. Just say... Hold on. Music. 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 Uh... Music. This. <clears throat> Pipe Organ Kind by James Roach. This is used in a page. This is totally gonna be John completing his quest. Like, absolutely, mm -hmm. totally, 100%. This is gonna be so cool. Okay, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, I think them is just the breaks, dude. Yeah. Uh... I think I, I didn't actually read this, so I'm gonna still. I mean, oh, okay, even okay. though everything in this timeline is about as crappy as it gets, this still seems kind of sad. Okay, then what you said, and I guess so. Uh, but what do you think uh, you will do with the, all the time you have left? Uh, okay. Um, I don't know, crowned old melancholy for a spell. Question my life choices. Probably bury my mom somewhere in the desert. Give it a quick funeral, says goodbye to her and everything else, and then curl up into a ball, and wait to unexist. Holy crap, that is the saddest thing I have ever heard. Ah, why do you even have me tell me, have to tell me that? Hey, you asked. No, that sucks. Don't do that. Meh, why not? Because it's stupid plan for crappy idiots. <laughs> <laughs> my Love God. you, John. Jesus freaking Christ, what a bird. I like how she capitalized <laughs> the C. Respect to the... To, to, to yeah. rep <laughs> respect to the man up there, you know? <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. continue. I think I might see succeed just from that burn. Yes. Laugh at my truly sick burn if you must, but everyone's getting on my case for being so defeatist. So, and that's the best plan you can come up with. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Uh, I didn't get on your case for being defeatist, though. I was acting tons more defeatist than you on, ac on account of the emotions from my mom's tragic corpse. Uh -huh. The troll's been the one busting your windsock, remember? That's true, I have been doing that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just think 
no matter who's going to stop existing when. If I do something proactive, then you should too. Even if I only in pro on principle. Uh, such as? Why don't you go see your denizen too? What? That's your denizen there, isn't it? No, it's a statue. <laughs> yeah, I know it's a statue. <laughs> I mean, it's a depiction of her, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. So, if I'm going to see mine, why don't you go see yours, too? Go see Nick's? Why? Why not? So I'm not a hero with the magic fix, literally everything powers that needs mastering? No, but you still have things to learn, don't you? Did you ever make that spike ball? Uh, no, but what would even be the point of that anymore? I don't know. It's just the thing you are going to set your mind to, but you haven't done yet. Just like I said, I was going to get that magic ring so you can give it to your friend, remember that? Yeah? I haven't done that, uh, that yet either, but that doesn't mean I have to give up on the idea. What if, after I see my denizen, what if I could still do that? Uh... Luna, you keep looking away, it seems. <laughs> okay, no, no I am, you read I am the three dots. Uh... Okay, you read the, you read the three dots. Okay, yeah. yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just saying, you have no idea what there is to learn from her. Maybe finding out that there is uh, what what there is to learn is most of what there is to learn. <laughs> what if making alien spike balls is only the beginning of understanding your powers? <laughs> what if she can help you channel some sort of incredible voidy thing? Voidy thing. Yes, like a windy thing, but with void instead of wind. <laughs> What's a windy thing? Hey, John, do the windy thing. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, a windy thing is obviously a bunch of damn wind blowing around. So true. So, you're saying she can teach me to make void blow around? No, I didn't mean that, that literally. I mean, maybe something more abstract, like, I don't know, learn to phase out of reality and somehow preserve yourself in the void, even if uh, I alter history. So, that may be when the time is right, you can just pop back into reality. Mm -hmm. Wow. You really think she can tell me how to do that? I have no idea. I'm just saying. Who knows? I mean, yeah, on, on John's side here. Not to be a wet wind of John, but that sounds far-fetched a sec. Oh, yes, probably. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, it just feels crappy leaving you here to have a sad funeral and then stop existing. Sometimes, John, just go to throw a sad funeral for your dead teen mom and then stop existing. Le shrug. Le shrug my labot. <laughs> I'm not going to see my denizen unless you agree to see yours. That is the deal. And it, that's final. Damn, son. As in, damn, literal offspring of some peeps I know. Crappy <laughs> straight. <laughs> Alive Lalonde, just to do what he says. A pointless, pointless obstinacy is a shared familial trait, which is most unknowable at the. Un most unwelcome at this time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. I'm gonna go see some big ass goddess of the night if it'll make you get this show and the stinking world already. Thank you. That is all I ask. So, uh, now? I. Hmm. I guess. Like this exact actual second then? Uh, I don't know. Probably. Alright, I guess we should, like, go then. <laughs> yeah, no time like the present, right? <laughs> right. Then, uh, so hey, <laughs> if this works, and I somehow erase you from history, I mean, this version of you... <laughs> yeah, if that happens, then, uh... It was nice to meet you. This is freaking brutal! <laughs> Hey. Oh, she did the freaking Terezi face. Oh. Yeah. I am not about to spend my final moments slowly bleeding to death while two human dorks 
oblivious to their own painfully evident romantic tension fumble through that drawn out series of awkward goodbyes. Didn't you just meet like today? Uh, yeah, yeah, um. <laughs> Um, I... Uh... Jagers, someone flog me with another crappy clown. I can't take one more minute with you adorable dweebs. You caught me at the bad, ta at the bad time, Egbert and Lalonde. Any other day, I would be teasing you about this in a playful attempt to make you both uncomfortable while giggling maniacally. But look at me! I said look at me! Does this strike you as a face which I pre prepared to giggle maniacally? Yeah, j Teresi is just not feeling it. <laughs> I am declaring this meeting of tragic yet adorable frickups completely and utterly adjourned. Now say goodbye. Yes, there you go. Just like that. Hey, what? You're just going to walk away? How about a hug? Yes, the thing you do with your arms. No, not me. Don't touch me with, the, with each other. Okay, just a little closer. And there you go. And this isn't a blast of research, people. <laughs> Blast off race. Okay. All right. I think that's going to do it. The goodbye has been secured. I mean, really. How do you even function on a day-to-day -day basis, <laughs> basis without me? How does anybody? <laughs> Maybe they didn't. I guess that that explains the mess we're in. Freaking Eureka. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I may be Cotton Candy's strongest soldier, but Roxygen is really good. I see. I see. They are so... <laughs> Terezi ships it. <laughs> Adorned, yes. Uh, Roxy girly poo, please get some help. Let John hug you. Then, well, there it is. Hop! <laughs> okay. Luna. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Lumao. Cartel, you're pretty funny. Hope I meet you again. Or at least some version of myself meets some version of yourself. Oof, what an abstract wish. Fantasy wish giver, dream Christ. <laughs> Don't even know that. Don't even know what that meant enough to make it happen or not. He and his loyal entourage of religion wizards just shrugging at each other. Um, okay, so. Good luck fixing all the crap, John. Anyway, I'm out. Fixing up the core of this sucker for dinosaur times. Later, dudes. Poof. Hop. And there she goes. Bye. <laughs> she didn't hear me. She was already un uh, underground. But yeah, I guess I will get going too. Thanks for the weird angry pepper talk, Terezi. See ya. Egbert, where the hell do you think you're going? But you just said, get back here. <laughs> oh my god, Terezi. <clears throat> okay, dang. What is it? Don't you think we should go over the actual plan first? Uh, I thought we just did that. I'm going to see Typhius. No, you nitwit. I mean, what you're going to do if you successfully learn to control your powers. And this is a good thing. This is like a... Terezia is a very good person to talk about this with, considering what we saw her do at the end of Act 5, Act 2 with, you know, mind... Mind aspect cool stuff. That's really cool, dude. They've got better... Oh, so I was right. She can become intangible. Yeah, she can. Interesting. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good point. So, what is your plan? I don't have one. I mean, other than to go talk to a monster who I presume to be a giant snake and see what happens. Do you have any ideas? Hmm. What do you think I should cha uh, change, Terezi? I don't know. I really should know, but... I don't. Hmm. <laughs> Why do you think you should know? Because I am a seer of mind! It is my job to know such things. I am supposed to foresee outcomes of certain actions and guide my friends to victory. But I've never been very good at using my powers. Look at where they've led me. I lost all faith in my abilities long ago. Sorry, John. I'm not sure I can help you. You can Can't you at least try? Try what, exactly? This is the... <laughs> this is exactly what John was just... <laughs> Just, first Roxy is helpless, then John is helpless, now Terezi is acting helpless, oh my god. Anything, like put your hands on your head like psychics do and just, uh, I don't know, try anything at all that might help me figure out what to do. 
just don't want to be zapping around time and space at random with no rhyme or reason to what I'm trying to fix. Please, Terezi, just try. I need your help. Yeah. Yeah. She's thinking. Okay, I will try something. Cool. I have no idea if this will work. Or if there is even any theoretical basis for it working. But I'll need to do so you to do something to help me try it. Okay, what? Try to hold a certain thought in your mind, as clearly and steadily as you can, and tell me what it is. A thought? Like, what kind of thought? I don't know, some idea. An image? Or maybe a phrase? That might be simpler. Sure, what kind of phrase? Any phrase, as long as you're s sure you'll be able to remember it clearly later on. Hmm. Interesting? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> me. So me. <laughs> okay, I got one. Good, tell me. There's no place like home. Oh. Okay, I think I can work with that. Now be sure you remember it. I will. Alright, stand back. Let's give this a shot. What a shot. What are you doing? Something is happening. Oh, she's screaming. Fizzle. What happened? Did it work? No. What, 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 what were you supposed to do? It did not. Well, damn. It was worth a shot, I guess. I'm sorry, I can't help you. I can't help anyone. You'd better go. But what will you do? I will probably just bleed to death in this desert alone and irrelevant. That's so crappy though. What if you- Stop! Just stop! There is nothing more for me to do. I don't even have a denizen to go visit. My friends are dead and they've wasted my life. It is over for me. And you are the only hope we have left. So get out of here. Oh. Terezi! Terezi! That's so sad. There is no place like home as a Wizard of Oz reference. I did not know that. When I first read the comic, <laughs> I looked something up and accidentally skipped a bunch of the comic. Oh. Really? How? What did you look up? I guess you're right. Okay. Off I go then. Shoo! Oh, hey. This is... I know what this is. It is John flying away. Yes, but the reference. Where is it? This. Exactly this. Not a redraw, like, like, like not, she, he didn't use the exact, like, thing. But this is definitely a reference. You see it? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I do. That's cool. If I master my powers, I guess I'll figure out, i figure something out. Don't worry, Terezi. And he is off. I'll make sure none of this ever happens. Yeah! Oh. Yeah, Sam. But we're back. Babies. We're back to Jade and... Kali. Um... Let's play the Lyrist for a change. Mm -hmm. Okay. I am sorry for repetition, but I want to reiterate for craft. Terezi taking Jade's shoes is also a refer reference to the Wizard of Oz, because taking shoes of a witch, uh, which I only realized today. Interesting, okay. The Goyles. I said it was pretty cool seeing it ahead of time as I read for the first time and then seeing it come into play later. Oh, Lamao, I know what you're talking about, Donnie. You should have listened to the hint. Oh, I think I know what you're talking about. The passwords, right? Mm -hmm. I know what they are because I looked at because I looked at um, the actual like uh, Homestack website a couple of times. So I know that they're there. 
Like I, I've seen them because because I've seen uh, like, like the earlier parts of Thalion's read through, and he had those. I'm not gonna explain what they are because I mean they're gonna come up eventually. Yeah, we'll see. I'm starting to. Oh wait, Jade. Yeah. <laughs> I'm starting to remember the things you showed me, she told me so vividly now. It's amazing what a creative project can do to get your mind turning. Who? What shall I draw first? The Land of Wind and Shade. That is where the story starts. I see. Which story exactly? Her story or yours? Hmm, both, as a matter of fact. My story began with a tragedy on Loas, which led to meeting her in the first place. And then, she used my memory of that tragedy as a starting point for her story, which turned out to be related. A tragedy on Loas? Wait... Huh? Am I supposed to know what this is referring to? Because I don't know. I don't know. remember, because I don't remember what they are referring to. Oh, okay. Huh. Oh, fascinating. I love stories. I know. <laughs> I'll start with mine, since that will make everything else make sense. So, go ahead and start drawing. What? Low ass. Right. Huh. That's her interpretation of the Land of Wind and Shade? That's cool. I mean, it's kind of accurate. Okay, oh, those are supposed to be the clouds. I thought that was something else. Yeah. How's this? Looks good. Don't forget to put a really tall house poking out of the top. Oh, yes, of course. Yeah. So, you say your story begins with a tragedy. What shall I draw next to the next to the place depicted this tragedy? Nothing yet. I'll get to that. But yes, the tragedy, is, the tragedy is why I was alone on the golden ship. It was not long after our three-year journey began. <gasps> oh my gosh, such pretty art. Hold on, I need to see, I need to see. Oh, yeah. Tumblr, Tumblr, Tumblr. Who made this? Because that is this the same artist that made the other Calliope art? Because this our, our art style is a little different. Nope. The last Tumblr post was announcing this merch. Guys, does anybody know if this was the same artist as, as before? Because hold on, if we... If we go back... It's been a while. It's, 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 it's been a while. Didn't? Yeah, okay, so there... Hmm. No, weird. I thought it would be somewhere here. The secret... Blah, blah, blah. Does it say the, what the art is? No. Mm -mm. Courtesy of Bam. Thank you, Emily. This is different art, so... Oh my gosh. And you want to find who does the, like, the usual Calliope art. Blah. If I do Control F... Calliope. Most of you probably... Uh, it appears that all of Calliope's art came from the barrel of Shelby's doodly firearms. Thanks, Shelb. Hmm. So is this that same person? Shall be cracked as Calliope's art. I guess their, their their style just changed. I mean, it's it's been more more than a year, so yeah. Look at chat, please. Yeah, okay, okay. Now I see. Yeah, yeah. I've I've noticed. I've noticed. I have noticed. Hello, overflow, overflow anims. Hello. It. Uh, this is my first stream. Hello there. Okay. Uh, continue, please. Yes. I was relaxing in our makeshift living room, giving John and Dave Sprite some space to themselves for a while so they could catch up. John wanted to visit his home again, so I happily obliged and shrunk them both down so they could hang out in his tiny tall house. Hmm. It seemed like the nice thing to do, but I came to regret that decision more than any I've ever made. I was minding my own business when out of nowhere... What happened? What? Loas exploded! This is some... How can... The... Okay, I was gonna say, is this some doomed timeline? But how can it be? How can it be a doomed timeline of that space between the walls? Because that's not even in a universe. What? Oh my gosh, this art. I 
couldn't believe it. It was totally inexplicable. There was no trace of them at all. They were both dead. I suppose it must have meant John's death was heroic. But I couldn't for the life of me imagine how. To me it was as pointless and arbitrary as a death could be. What? I looked within myself as hard as I could to see if there was some power I had in all my omnipotence to bring them back. But I couldn't. They were gone. I would spend the next three years on that ship without my two best friends. Sure, there were still consorts and chess guys to keep me company. But the boss, but the loss was too much for me to bear. I felt so alone. How, when did this, what happened, what is this? Huh? Also the art is good and, oh my gosh, what? Saw some, yeah. Dad! Weeks and months went by. I didn't have the slightest sense of how quickly or slowly time was passing. Any sense of purpose in reaching the destination had vanished. And delicious though it was, no amount of Nana's cake could bring me comfort. Aww. Toward the end of the journey, when I feeling when I was feeling particularly despondent. Z I fell asleep and had a dream. And that is when I met a very powerful, strangely charismatic creature. Her name was Calliope. So this is not the jade that we saw die on Land of Frost and Frogs? Is this, is this, is this a different jade? Somehow? <laughs> what? Whoa, okay. As I said, she was somewhat like you, and yet so unlike. Her presence was so serious and grave. Her hollow eyes are piercing, but not hostile. But the prevailing sense I got from her was one of loneliness. Before she even said a word, I could feel it somehow, that this was a deeply lonely soul. Until I met her, I thought I was the loneliest person in the universe. But a feeling told me she had been here by herself for a long, long time. I felt sorry for her. And relating to her plight helped me overcome the feelings of intimidation. So we began to talk. We traded stories about ourselves. She spoke of her brother she killed. I spoke of the brother I lost. And when I mentioned John's death, that is when she became very serious again. She began to recount how John had died, repeating to me the same story I just told you. She described the spontaneous destruction of Lois, which left me alone for years. I wondered why she was recounting this tragedy that happened to me, and for that matter, uh, how she knew of it herself. She went on to say that Lois was destroyed because John's tennis end had suddenly woken up. Huh. Typhus, a great monster of truly terrifying power, she said he had destroyed his land and slayed his own hair of breath, not out of malice, but to make a slight correction. I asked her, what do you mean, correction? Whoa, the Calliope with the full green cheeks too. She, looks so she cool. said that the John from my reality and his entire planet needed to be erased. And that the slumbering denizen in all his mysterious wisdom knew this. She told me that the dreams of a denizen draw from the, draw from the same well of potential okay, sorry, from sorry, which sorry, every sorry, conceivable- Sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah, pause yeah, yeah. for a second. It's okay. This is okay. I'm back. Hi, back. Okay, uh, 
She told me that the dreams of a denizen draw from the same well of potential from which every conceivable possibility arises. The same place Skyler gets its power from. So if an agreement with a denizen is reached in one reality, that same denizen in another reality must become aware of it and respond accordingly. Huh? It seems that John, somewhere, in some other plane of existence, had made just such an agreement. That's so weird! How can then be there be an alternate version of the path between the two windows? Between the two fenestrated planes? How is that even possible? No. That is not inside of a universe. That is not a universe. How is that even... What, yeah. How? That's not something that she said... happens. Okay, continue. Ow. Ow. Ouch. What, what happened? What, what, what are you... What? I cracked my... my legs bones super, super hard. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm fine. Uh... She said that the John I knew, like herself, was only one version of a person. There was a different version of John from another reality, always to play a more significant role. You see, the John from that reality, in an act of desperation, had gone to see Typhus and struck a bargain with him. She would go on to explain the nature of that bargain in the next part of her story. But from my perspective, the consequences of this bargain was to lose my friends, and to live that for years without understanding why. I think I'm still hurt, but I was so relieved to at least understand the reason, and to realize their senseless deaths were actually serving a bigger purpose. I thank you for letting me know. So this is some alternate Jade too. This is not the the the, the Jade. Oh, yeah. Wow, that's odd. So how did how did how did this Jade die? She told me she was not human, and had no frame of reference for empathizing with my feelings, but if there was one thing she could relate to, it was the feeling of being alone. The feeling of wanting for what seems to be like, like eternity by yourself, until finally your purpose presents itself. Huh. Hmm. I feel sorry for her. Uh, for myself, I suppose. But then again, that feeling is nothing new. <laughs> it's an old statement she made, though. What? Sorry. Not having the frame of reference for empathizing with human feelings. If you asked me, I would say I have the advantage to relate to both humans and cherubs. So when you describe your feelings of sadness over losing friends, I'd have more than enough grounds for com cons um, commens commiseration. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Do you think this version of me never... Never what? Never had human friends like I did? I, I have no idea. What a strange thought. To grow up with only my brother for company, and not even have my human friends to get, to get me by. What a dreadful fate, the poor thing. Maybe that was the difference? What let me... What let her predominate over her brother, whereas I was to, um... Humanly socialize to I succeed in my cherubic rise of passage. That's an interesting thought. Could be. And also, yeah. I'm pretty sure since they would that would be a doomed timeline Calliope and a doomed timeline Caroleborn, they wouldn't be able to contact like another just like another universe in the same way, right? Because they would have to obviously in that if they if she was able to, she would have to contact a doomed version of that of like another universe, right? But because not not because like it would be weird or something, but you know, just because we haven't seen that happen. So mm -hmm. in that in that situation, uh, God, I'm losing myself on my own argument. I in that situation in, in that situation that would have to be a doom do doom the timeline that she was contacting. But that's not something that's possible, right? Because we haven't seen it happen before. There is a, whenever there is like a sp split, right? It's always like, uh, you know, the, 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 the tro when there was, was like a doomed timeline thing, the other tr the, the trolls couldn't view that from their from their like chat clients or, or anything. They could only view the alpha timeline. So, mm -hmm. hmm. Brain mush, you talk too much. Sorry. <laughs> It's fine. Did anyone else actually understand, or was I yapping too much? 
Ah, BRB is such a classic. Hi, Baka and Dad. God damn it, they JJ Enigma. She had no frame of Could be. She had no frame of what the reference. Thank you. Good point, Craft. <laughs> <laughs> Name a better duo between space players and loneliness. Hmm. Okay, continue as Jade. <laughs> Could be. Yes. Could be. I don't know enough about Cherub Rites of Passage to say either way. More Rites of Passage either, for that matter. So, then what happened? Right. Uh, anyway, that's when she began his story in earnest. The one she summoned me in my dreams to tell me. The story of the other Jawan who made a, who made a deal with Typhus. It began with the same place minded, Lois. So, go on. What? Draw Lois again. Oh, uh, wait, all over again? Uh, um, no, you can just copy the first one we did. Oh, what a lovely idea. I'd have to, in case to hold up the pace of your exciting tale with a bunch of superfluous doodling. Alright. Good enough? Yes, but there are also supposed to be glitches around. Glitches? What do you mean by glitches? Like computer -y glitches, I think. That sounds hard to draw. Okay, why don't we not worry about showing the glitches for this story? They would just make it harder to see what's going on. Which is probably the point now that I think about it. This is um, this is Hasi talking to Shelby and Shelby saying I will not draw the glitches, that will be too hard to me for me. <laughs> <laughs> the point of what? I never thought much about it. It just seemed like a weird detail she mentioned mentioned. But I guess it was some strange form of corruption in their session that made everything harder to understand. Where did the corruption come from? No idea. I guess it was just one more way everything got messed up for them. Like, just another surreal obstacle for a hero to overcome. Oh, that reminds me. You need to draw John there as well. right -o. Ah, Windy Boy. Yeah. There you go. One hero sans surreal obstacles. <laughs> When she mentioned that I didn't give it a second thought, I, I didn't give it a second thought, but now that I'm trying to reconstruct everything and tell you what to draw, hmm. Hmm. I guess when you're trying to tell a story, it forces you to think a lot more about everything than when you are just listening to one. That's quite true. Perhaps you should to start writing, or did how did she begin? Uh, let me think. Maybe we should pause before I go on? Pause? Like, some sort of intermission. I'm gonna <laughs> okay. So, so I can collect my thoughts a bit and to give the audience a little breather between two significant What arts. audience? <laughs> <laughs> we were at it for a pretty good while there, after all. What audience? Well, that would be you in this case. Oh, I know. I can do the like, quick story about the antics of the silly consorts on the golden ship before moving on. <laughs> yes, good, correct. Oh! Salamander, turtle, crocodile, <laughs> and uh, iguana. There so groovy. Groovy. One of the things I did to pass the time on the ship was give them funny names. Let's meet our cast of characters for this intermission, shall we? Oh my god, dude, Jade. They already have names. Like, like I mean, like they could, they can name themselves. Unlike the, unlike the Carapaceans, you can actually understand them. <laughs> okay, never mind. Huh. Let's see. There was Babalupagus, Tips Ahoy, uh -huh. Nakbi Nimble, yeah, Slowpoke Malone, Slowpoke Malone, <laughs> Jade. <laughs> okay. Okay, Detective collapse budget. Stop for a second. Stop for a second. 
<laughs> okay, so to summarize what we know, in one timeline, Jot had to deal with Typhius out of desperation. I'm assuming that's like the one that we were just monitoring because of this deal that Typhius killed a John in another timeline to make a correction. Blah, I don't know. Sans, 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 sans? <laughs> Thips ahoy, oh my gosh. Um... Craft, I'm just gonna say this section is meant to be confusing and you don't need to understand it all at first, but it's fun to see you theorize. That is what I'm doing. I want to keep theorizing. I don't want to just consume this blindly, okay? I want to actually think of what's going on. Once a split happens, it is impossible to contact other timelines, so this split must have happened early in her life. Interessante, yes. So th th this is what I was thinking, yeah. Thank you for validating my thought, Jane. Jane. Okay. Detective Claps Budget. Okay. Fidgety Herbert. <laughs> Fidgety Herbert. Dr. Snossages. <laughs> Dr. Snossages. And Yiffy Yiff. Yiffy Yiff. Jade! Huh? Pa 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 pa. I'm sorry, but I don't care about this right now. Your concert friends are so very cute and their names are silly and I love them all, but I, <coughs> I want to hear the rest of the story. Please, let's go back to illustrating her story. I'm so curious. <laughs> I, I like them though. I, li I want to hear about these fellas. <laughs> um, please, 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 please. Wow, okay, sorry. Yes, you're right, this is a stupid diversion. Let's continue. Uh, Kali, your hand. Oh, did she get comfortable enough? Oh, <laughs> never mind. It's a bug. Oops, uh, pay no attention to that. Did you carry on? Okay. So, anyway, like I said, she just finished telling me that she was uh, able to beat her brother in this reality. But apparently that wasn't supposed to happen. So she lived out the rest of her life in a doom timeline and eventually died. She didn't mention how. And then then she did this kind of fancy transition. And I don't think I'll do it justice. A transition to a story about my brother, who was stuck in a doom timeline too. I think I'll mess it up if I try to match what she said word for word. Huh. She had a really fanciful way of putting things. But there is no need to reiterate what she <coughs> recite what she said. Just tell me this. <coughs> Just tell me the story in your own voice, as you have already been doing. It will be more fun that way. Okay. So the bottom line was almost all our friends had died, and John's only hope was to return to his planet and attempt to complete his personal quest. Yeah. So that's that's what we know. This is like. This is that John that has left Terezi there, right? And Roxy, Roxy, Roxy yep. went to her underground. Seems so for now. Seems, yeah, definitely. As you know, we have all personal quests. We all have personal quests that are unique to our planets. The nature of the quests is never easy to understand at first. They are presented to us through enigmatic riddles conveyed through the lore of the land. For John, it was to journey to the place where constellations danced beneath the clouds. Hmm. It was said that the hair of breath was to free the stars from the shade and release them into heaven. It's been so long. It's been so long since we've heard this. Yeah. And the fact it's still being mentioned is very cool, I think. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Even after it's all got so yeah, much more yeah. grandiose. Freeing the fireflies is still something that's, that's mentioned here, yeah. This was just a mysterious way of saying that he really, what he really had to do. I have actually a question, Luna. Um, do you have a place where we can yeah. end soon-ish? Not soon soon, but soon-ish. Like, perfect place. I something. think so. I think so. Let me look up a bit ahead, but I think there should be one in not Thank too long. Hmm, well, actually, this is kind of perfect. This here, right now? No, 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 this is what I'm looking at. Okay. Okay, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, I know, I know, yeah, we can I go on. I wonder if the flash with pipe organ kind is coming, like, super soon. I would kind of want that to be, like, in a separate stream. Fudgy to Herbert, let's go. Oh my god, yiffy yiff. I just had a sickening sense of deja vu, but for, for the future. I know what you mean. 
I know. I know. <laughs> so, how is it? Hmm? How is it? What do you mean? Like the, how is what? The part that you found, is it perfect? Oh, yeah, no, it is good. Okay. I said it's good. Can you continue reading now? Yeah, I was waiting. The stars were actually fireflies. They've been flying around trapped beneath the overcast sky ever since John first brought Lois into existence, into existence by his arrival. And paradoxically, they'd been imprisoned there for ages even before that. Such is the way of our lands. We are newly born the day we arrive, and yet they always were. Mm. Hey, it's this place! It's been so long! Yeah. Oh, that's interesting, actually. Hold on, let me get back, go back to that. Such is the way of our lands. They are newly born the day we arrive, and yet they always were. Yeah, so so it's, it is it is basically like Deltarune Dark Worlds. <laughs> Since, you you know, you come in, that's and, and it's, it's, it's newly created, and yet it has history. Mm -hmm. Cool, 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 cool. It's been so long oh. since we've seen this palace. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay. Yeah. They just realized. Three the fireflies. Okay, hold on. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. I just now realized the entire palace is a ginormous pipe organ, too. I just now realized it that. is. I yeah. did not re see that. Oh my god. To free the fireflies, John would have to play a special song. Hey! It had to be played just right to summon the breeze through the pipes. But there was a problem. The pipes were all clogged with oil. The first day John came to his land, oil began nosing up from the core, flooding the pipes and filling the oceans. To play the song, first he would need to clean up the oil, and to do that, he would need to face the slumbering one himself. He would need to face Typhius. Yes, because it was, it wasn't it said that despite Typhius and like being like, oh, the person that is like the embodiment of the whole planet, it's still like his fault for this somehow? And the, the the underlings being there too. Oh, cool. <laughs> but as he wandered through the catacombs down to the planet's core, he wasn't thinking about freeing fireflies or cleaning up oil. He was seeking the help of his denizens to master a power he couldn't control. Luckily for him, denizens always seem to understand what you want. And more importantly, what you need whether you know it or not. Interesting. Is something wrong, Caddy? Hmm. Go ahead and draw Typhus. Oh, uh, yes, um, uh... You do know what he looks like, don't you? I believe I do. It doesn't have to be perfect, just draw a big green snake monster. A big green snake monster, you say? Who? Okay, interesting, mm. interesting play on the fact that we as readers have avoided seeing the denizens all this time. Very interesting. Yeah, this is like. <laughs> what? Uh, she doesn't want to draw this. Okay, I'll, I'll wait for a couple more lines. Okay. <laughs> Yes, a snake monster with the most unspeakably hideous face you can imagine. Why? But you don't have to be too literal about that. Feel free to draw something a little more representational. Representational. Mm. Uh, representational, hmm. sorry. I am not sure if I am particularly comfortable with rendering such imagery. <laughs> you know why? Why? She would be drawing prawn. <laughs> Of our species. Oh my god! Oh, that's why. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's. Oh, that is so stupid. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> the joke is set, smut. <laughs> Susie is Terezi confirmed canon? Oh, sure. Why not? Delta Runa's post, Scratch Undertale. <laughs> I've seen that meme. 
technically, if you think, okay, I'm gonna freaking talk about inverted fate for a second again. If you think about okay. it, the way the, it's set up in its prologue video is way more like it, it, that is just straight up post Scratch Undertale. Like you can't tell me otherwise. Like if you watch the prologue to Inverted Fate, that is just what Inverted Fate is. <laughs> anyway, what the hell? Homestack art isn't supposed to be this good. Yeah, <laughs> General Mituna. That are on Dark World vibes. That are on the is Homestack art. Damn, I didn't get didn't get that the first time around. Nobody can hide smart material in Homestack. Damn it, true it is. Okay, continue, please. Sorry. Yeah. Let me sip you a moment. Sippy, what? Kind of rough. Good. I mean, not good that it's rough. Good that you're sipping. <sighs> yes. Uh, wait, no, okay. Uh, why not? Uh, okay. Ba -ba -da -ba. Where, 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 where. Okay. It strikes me as uh, rather indecent. Uh, for reasons I would be too embarrassed to explain. <laughs> it's okay. Why didn't I draw it? Uh, very well, but you must excuse me if I giggle. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, but I don't see what's so indecent about a big old snake. Same for what's so indecent about buckets. Tiki. <laughs> <laughs> lol. Luna say lol. lol. Okay, good. Thank you. <laughs> At most. The next page is funny. That, yeah. that, that, this more so looks like a Typhius minion than Typhius Typhius. Because this is literally. Yeah, scroll down. That's that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> small john small john yeah uh that's cool though that how this uh, this mirrors the yalda bow page of uh, uh aranea talking about okay. caliborn's journey like i'm pretty sure this is the exact same pose yeah cool 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 but i do i do like i do actually like how she did draw it very similar to like a type typhius minion but like longer because <laughs> you know that's that's yeah. what that's what she knows yeah that's that's what that's what was in her house Mm-hmm. Okay. Small. Uh, when John got to the core, he arrived to find Typhus May awake and ready for him. <laughs> Giggle. <laughs> he was 10 presented with a choice. <laughs> Stop, you're gonna make me crack up too. This part is serious. I apologize, please. <laughs> Go on. Alright then. Interesting. Um... Is this gonna be a Secret of Mana song again? Ooh. A transition again, like that? Uh, covered in bleachiness. Whoa. I was right! It's, it's glitching. This is what he really saw. Still don't see his face. Yep. His choice was presented as a kind of riddle, spoken in a language only he could understand, and spelling out the conditions he must mm. accept. But speaking from experience, once a player is given a choice between two courses of action, it will hardly feel like a choice at all. Mm. If the heart is in the right place, then the right thing to do always seems obvious. So John accepted it in his Denison's terms. And with that... Alright. Typhius. Wow. Wow. <laughs> the fact that we're talking about this, just... Mm, yeah. Mm. It's been too long. Typhius opened Vams to the core and flooded it with oil. Why? What? What? There was no way out. He could not transform into wind because he was completely submerged. So he was faced with two possibilities. Either he could figure out how to make himself disappear completely using the ability he hoped to master, or he could drown in the oil. Ah. 
That is a very rough way to learn the ability, Typhius. Oh my god. Inscription R's and comprehensible terrors. Why inscription R's specifically? So quickly, I love it. <laughs> huh. Cover yourself in oil, stop. <laughs> Drowning obviously wouldn't have been would have been bad, blah. <laughs> but disappearing wouldn't be much better. He would appear somewhere else, having made no progress on his personal quest. His planet would still be polluted, and he would be no closer to playing his song. Somehow he understood the only way to cons the only way was to conceive of a third option, oh. an idea beyond the simple binary set of outcomes before him. And interestingly. It was coming to this understanding which gave him the first glimpse of how to control the power. He realized it wasn't himself that he needed to make this appear. What? It was the oil! Huh? He dispersed every drop throughout existence. What? This is- <laughs> This, 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 this is where, this is where that comes in? This is where the oil comes in? Really? This is where the oil comes in. I've... Oh, uh, another freaking hand thing. Oh my god. Hello, Dave. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me, let me actually, like, take in what I'm seeing here. What, like, all of these flashbacks. Oh my god. Oh my god. Data, data structures for dummies. Carrot cake. <laughs> Disaster risk. <laughs> okay. Oh man. This here, yeah. I remember checking a page, like an early page, and this. I I knew of this, and I knew that it was called Redcon because two um, live bloggers that I read uh, have commented on the fact that. Like because because like when they when they saved the images to put into their blog, they would be obviously exposed to the name of the of the file, and this the, the, these files with the oil or the arms would have redcon in their name. So they I already knew of that oh, up, like a, since a while ago, but yeah, wow, well, okay. Here, yeah, Rosalie and broken walls, the daily chronographer. Space, space rocks, knock local burbs off, bl block off. <laughs> Not bad. Oh my god. Manthro chap. It's been so long since this. The trophies on the wall. <laughs> Snake. Here too. I just now realized that this is the same sh safe that is used in the... Intermission in the in the like as the as the felt safe in the in, yeah. in the felt manner, huh? Dave, the frog ruins. Mm, stuff in the intermission too, just all throughout canon. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that image too, I suppose. Uh, Non-canon too, just existence. Mm. Big splot on the ship right there. Wow. Nay. Operation register. Huge binge. Blah blah. I like how it differentiates. This is the ink. This is the oil. <laughs> Hi, Hussy. <laughs> oil in the ocean. Oh no. Huh. A memory here. Cool. I was so blown away by this because, you know, I obviously read it when it was done, so I could see the oil from the start. Mm -hmm. And God, <laughs> it's just the biggest backlash in this story for me. Oh my gosh, yeah, okay. Read the, read the blurb. Yeah. Down, 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 down. Leaving a little mark for anyone who might notice, signifying his final mastery over his confining reality. Huh. 
Hey! The dead safari. That was a dream. But do it fast, okay? Please don't make me bleed to death slowly. Wow. That was such a cool scene, this, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> Both. Oh, and this, John <laughs> talking to Vriska there. I'm pretty sure, yeah. I think so. You approach Act 6, almost. But the big man has the, the the big woman has the rock. Oh no! <laughs> Told you it's everywhere. The snippets. Ah, uh, the, the 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 dream bubble with with uh, old John and Vriska. Oh wow! Yeah, Act Six. There's Act Six. Hmm. Not on him. Not on Friglish. Yeah. Wow, that's a, that's, a, that's a big oil splooch right here in this dream bubble. Oh, huh. Interesting. This is a cool panel. I forgot about this panel, but I like it a lot for some reason. I don't know. Yeah. Terezi Jean. Hi, Terepi. I go drunk. In the logo. <laughs> Inside of the photo. In the, <laughs> in the logo here. Oh my god. That's insane. In the logo here with the re previous retcon too. And this retcon too. Wow. In the Maris. And in Homosac too. One singular panel of Homosac. I mean, here too, I guess, but yeah. <laughs> More importantly. Slash oil retcon. Uh, uh. Interesting. Let me see. I didn't know that was there. Slash oil retcon. All of the pages. Huh. A list of the pages affected. Oh, cool. Yeah. Here. That's cool. I saw the I saw the missing spaces. I was like, oh, dog scratch. <laughs> let me let me look at some random pages here. Okay, this we saw. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Quite. Over here. Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool. Ah, oh, that is so cool. Senator Senator Lemons now true. Ratcon the second. S John cover everything in oil. <laughs> Check this crap out. Uh. Oh, morning, Star. Hello. Am I ruining the party by saying that these pages had all added to them after this update? And when the... no, 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 no. I think that's very cool, actually. The fact that they were all edited like that, uh, because like it affecting previous panels as this page went out. I think that's honestly cool, like as cool as if the, as if it would be all there all the time. Honest to go, honest to glob. So the, yeah, because if you guys don't know, since I'm using new reader mode on uh, an official Homestuck collection, these here splooches, they weren't there before this these pages. Like, they were just not there. Yeah, that's the only thing I don't like about the collection. I think, no, I think that's wonderful. I think that's wonderful. I think they should, oh, that's fine. should be I just think it's not good. I think it's better. Because it does just removes the wonder of it. Blah. Leaving his planet clean. And the pipes clear. <gasps> yep. Oh, it's gonna happen now. Finally, they were ready to let the breeze flow. The breeze flow. So he could play his song. <gasps> hold on. No, 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 no. Okay, so it's this flash. Okay, hold on. I need to, I need to actually like uh, disable the music. Oh my god. Okay, so it's. I told you I wanted this to be next stream, but fine, fine. It's way too early for it to be next stream if you wanted to, like, unless you wanted to end right now. Uh, what if I did want to? Uh, I would slap you in the face. No, the oil update. Okay. It's organ time, pipe, okay. Pipe organ kind. I've been anticipating this since this was unlocked, which was like, Somewhere in like I think Act Six, Act Three, maybe, probably. I mean, no, if you want to go then here, there's a ton of dialogue after. 
we could end here or like at the at the flash here or after the flash because after this is a lot of dialogue let's okay okay you know what we usually end later but we started earlier and this stream has been yeah, way yeah. long already i'd say that i yeah, don't know we've been streaming for four hours yeah 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 so that's because i just want to say that yeah um we've been streaming for a while and honestly i want some of the um some of the uh, quote-unquote evening actually like part of the night to myself still so mm -hmm. you know what this will be the last page that we watch after that uh, the next stream after like in the next undertale stream or whatever we will watch it again and then continue cool don't end this on a cliffhanger no we will watch it we will watch it right people, now people. yeah we watch it and end yeah that's what i'm saying that is in fact what i am saying pipe up you pipe yeah pipe up pipe organ kind by james roach the actual planet the fact is it, it will look so weird without the oil Wow. It looks so magic. Oh. And I remember how this was something we were shown with Vriska and the other John. Da -da 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 -da. Ginormous windy thing. Oh my goodness gracious. Look at that. Look at the breeze flow from everywhere. I'm getting chills. <laughs> Crample hat, by the way. Crample hat. Yeah. I just now realized why he's playing this melody, because obvi obviously he knows it, he played it on even bigger windy thing than before, oh my gosh. Obviously he knows it, it's like he played the Showtime Pumping Piano that right? way. Whoa, the Titanic. Oh! <laughs> All of the dust was blown, blown out of the cartridge, oh my god. And that's how John fixed the universe. I guess maybe it's for now. We'll see if he actually does the retcon that he that he said he would. At least of the glitches. <laughs> yeah, of the glitches. That was so cool. <laughs> John did the windiest thing. Yeah. This, this IMO is the best joke in Homestuck. <laughs> the dust literally got blown out of the cartridge from the inside. That is so funny. Yeah, it's so awesome. This is one of my few favorite flashes in Act 6. What are your other favorites? He did it. He did the windy thing. The, the, like, the, yeah, but bi bigger windy thing. He already did the windy thing, but bigger windy thing. Ultimate mega super windy thing. True. <laughs> I missed it because I was on Homestuck meetup though. Oh, funny. oh hold on. Uh, I missed game over. No, I missed it though because I was on a Homestuck meetup though. Funny. What Homestuck meetup? Like IRL somewhere? With some homestuck fans. That's 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 wow. Okay. Hi hoy, by the way. Hi hi. Hi hello. He blew in the cartridge. Everything I was just a build up to take uh, for for uh, take the cartridge out and blow it on and <laughs> blow on it joke. <laughs> that's that's so good, dude. And then he did the windy thing. You're the funniest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> That's so cool. From one era of breath to another, this crap's so cool. Are you an era of breath too, Nate the Taylor? Wow. The windiest thing. Yeah, okay. 
I think my other uh, favorite Act 6 flashes are like Jane Enter and Caliborn Enter. Okay. And then he did the windy thing. Yes, IRL meetup. That's so cool, Hoy. Hope you had fun. Seriously. This comic starts with wind chimes, and here we are with similar wind and metal tubes. Well, even before wind chime foley, it was, uh, you know, this. Wind chime foley comes as the second S page in the comic. This is the first one. Dun dun dun, dun dun dun, dun dun. Yes. Also, I haven't been here We've often. Gone full circle. Wait, what? Oh, that 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 the other flash was started <laughs> on its own. <laughs> I haven't been it would here have often been cool because if I didn't want... have a laptop. I haven't been here often because I didn't want problems with spoilers, and also personally don't enjoy Act Six that much. I think it's wonderful, so, like so far. I mean, so far we're near the end. <laughs> You're almost done. Yeah. Um, I do definitely get to get a lot of the criticism, but I don't think it's all bad, uh, definitely. Like, there is so much here to enjoy still. I understand why people, some people are frustrated with its overall structure, but I don't think that they can... I don't think it's very fair to say that all of it is irrelevant, horrible, and you shouldn't read it. I think that's just not giving it a fair shake at all, and it does, that does deserve a fair shake. And that you should creel yourself now. No. Yeah. I loved it when John said it's wind in time and then he went it all over the narrative. True, true, oh, true, yeah. true, true. Now, yes. I can make you watch Game Over Reanimated. <gasps> yes, you're correct. I will do that after this. So after I end the stream. Hello. More pain. Yay. Ba -da -ba -ba. The craft session would be wild. I think so. Finally, Dennis and Closure. My thirst has been quenched. I am sated. Oh, were you were you like catching up on double speed? Oh, that's kind of a shame for that. But that's fine. That's that. You, it, ah, yes, correct. That's yes. I thought that was intentional for a sec. Yeah, for a sec, I also thought that you could hear wind in this flash now because it was changed. I <laughs> for a second I did thought to think that, but no, it was just the other flash playing on its own in the other stem in the other card. <laughs> Now that we are past game over, I can recommend the animation S of Gods and Witches, which utilizes the music and uh, basically turns all events from RNA insertion to game over uh, into a single S page. Interessante? Okay. Of Gods and Witches. <sighs> I cried when I, uh, I watched this flash the first time. Remember, I accidentally skipped most of this for my first time, lol. Aww. Act 6 is so big, so it has some of the lowest parts of the comic, but also some of the best parts. Yes, Game Over reanimated it's so good. I will see it. No, but I heard the haunting refrain and noticed it right away, peak. No, absolutely, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna play it again. Gosh. Great recommendations is JG make money yeah, to what uh, Azorgail Chimekazikura said. Sorry if I butchered your name. The full You're Italian, Kenny? Are you Italian, Kenny? Let me see something. Um. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Okay, so. The flash itself is two minutes, while this song is five minutes and four seconds. So yeah, it makes sense why uh, we only see this um, this motif. But uh, after that, it's Warhammer, Zelihu, Explore, Liquid, Negrosity, Doctor, Liftoff, Rahal, Liquid, and Toccata and Fugue in D minor. Oh, from Bach. Okay, <laughs> cool. Wait, are you you're Italian too, Donny Cat? 
Or are you just proud of your pasta? There are... Wait, there are more Italians in the chat? <laughs> You're John Egbert in real life flanware? So cool. Don't worry, guys. Italy will be obliterated in two days. No, stop. I don't want it to be obliterated. Come on, now. <laughs> the horses are coming. The horses are coming. Stop. Yeah. <laughs> there are more Italians in this world. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, I'm not supposed to break character like this, but uh, buonasera, Donicat. <laughs> <laughs> Break character? What are you pretending not to be Italian on a day-to-day -day basis? <laughs> I'm pretending to be English. Called it the power of Bath for all but of a pipe organ kind. Well, the for a full song, I don't think it was heard in that particular part we, we heard in the flash, but yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. You know what? This is where we end. I will. We will see more uh, of this whole thing. Actually, wait, where did I... I lost the frickin' place. <laughs> where? I need to go back. Blah, 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 blah. Fix this, yeah. That's already two sets, of, like, two, like ten chapters here. Oh my god. Yeah. It's so weird. Okay, that's... that's that You're one. weird. Oh. Um... Yeah, we will continue next time, but next time, next time is gonna be Undertale, and after that we're gonna go back to Homestack. Though, I don't know, I, I, I still want to, like, this, do this, and this at some point. Should we do Paradox Space before we continue after this, or how, like, how do we do this? Should we, like, read a Paradox Space comic at the end of, like, every stream we go, like, from, from this point or something like that? Maybe something similar? Uh, I think we could just read all of them uh, on the beginning of next stream, maybe, on the next Omsex yeah. stream. But that, there's so much of them, though. Oh. Okay. Maybe half of uh, next time's stream. <laughs> However, okay, actually, well, new idea. What if we... S I, again, what I said before, like, about, like, a little bit each stream, and then maybe we could start now? I don't know, like, I... I didn't want to continue the, the comic match because we have already witnessed so many okay, important well, things today, but like... Two things. Yes. One, uh, I'm not feeling very well. I've okay. been kind of waiting for the stream to start. That makes sense. Yeah. You're, you're, you're and two, idea. there are not enough streams left for this to happen. Ah, I see. How many do you reckon are left if we do like at least two hours each time? Um, two hours is little. Yes, our average is like three. Our average is three. Wait, three hours. I, it, I feel like yeah. it's always at least below three, like or like. Sometimes mostly. it's two. Sometimes it's two and a half. Sometimes four. Mm. Um. Anyway, I would say if we continue, if we do, if we do three hours of stream every time, there are about eight to eleven streams left, maybe. Wow, that's insane. Actually, no, maybe more like 12 to 15. I see. We're definitely in the very odd place in the, co in the in the story right now. Everything feels like weirdly familiar and also foreign because everybody is That's cool, dead. And, you know, it's like we're stuck in a weird place. The jade I thought was the, the jade is a different jade also, it turns out. It's not a DD jade. <laughs> it's interesting. So yeah, um, question of the day, let's think. Is it game over or not? <laughs> okay, most shocking death in game over to you when you first saw it. Like, I, like you really mm -hmm. didn't think they would kill off that character, you know, or show them being killed off in that flash, you know, something like that. Most shocking one to you. That's it. That that is. I think the... most people will say Carcat. You think so? Yeah. Dave. I mean, Dave is Dave makes sense. Actually, I would I would say Dave. <laughs> okay, but that that is still the the question of the day. So you can comment on that yes, if yes. you want. Um, like the vid the, the video, the vod, the the stream. 
uh thank you for for, 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 for like so, so many people watching at the time we were watching uh, game over by yes the way. so thank cool. you everyone thank for you. helping us with yeah. the yes. new thank best you. viewer count yes thank you so much thank you so much for that uh subscribe we have notifications because i don't have a schedule i probably should get one soon but for now no so yeah bell is over there and comment uh, what i said if you want to if you are so inclined and yeah See you next time, lads. Subscribe! Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Oh, they didn't even notice Ace was here. You didn't even say hi. I keep, <laughs> so I, I keep it like probably like the last five minutes or so. Oh yeah. my god, Ace. Yeah. <laughs> this happens every time. We were here for four hours and a half in the VC. To be fair, I was asleep for like at least three of that. Okay. Makes sense. Makes sense. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye, everyone. We won't